know, hopefully live. <sighs> Let's see if it works this time. Yay, May? No? Looks like it's working. You guys seeing anything with it? See anything with what? The stream? Come on, man. Is it playing for you? Can you see? see? Nothing, nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Says some oh, stream. Got live. Oh, is that, is that, on I got a live. Oh, it's I got live. live. Titus says it's good. All right, good. Okay. Says, oh, Two watching. Oh, that, is that, on I got a live. Oh, <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks. Okay. All right, everyone. Welcome back to another live stream here on. Arc Survival Evolved here at the Game Vault. We got a new guy joining us tonight, Trench. You might recognize him from our uh, our uh, comment section and all that. He's been a uh, longtime viewer, and I think he and his son play actually on our community server as well, which is kind of cool. So, boom. And looks like, Hello, hey, Neil, what's going on? We just went live. We got Neil joining us tonight. We got um, Titus, Hobbit, Gameplay. We got <coughs> all six of us I'm here. Me. And you just got to watch your foul mouth tonight, Neil. <laughs> Try to keep it family friendly. I effing won't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but yeah, I am still not getting this as a uh, live stream. That's so weird. Let me try something different. Oh, okay. It's shown up. All right. It did something different. All right. Well, whatever. It's working. Ah, uh, so I'm taking mods, but I'm trying to get in. Good deal. And you said Trench joined the chat? Yep. He just got his mic turned off. And same with Titus. He got his mic turned off. Well, Titus ran off for a, a schmuck. <laughs> oh, yeah, look at that. Here's Trench. So, Beaver... Anky, Dodicarus. Yeah, I'm here. Hey, what's going on, Trench? Welcome to the party. What, what, what do we use for thatch? We use there a strike is... still, or it's just there it's is. just taking a while to show the game server. Yeah, no problem, man. Yeah, that first time you're gonna log in, you got to download all the mods for it and all that, so it's gonna take you a minute. No worries. Yeah, we were using a theory for thatch, Hobbit. Because it's kind of like, kind of a no-brainer there, I think, you know? Yep. Barry, RG. Yes. I'm in. You're in. Dyla. All right. Ethereum. Mutations. Mm -hmm. So, I'm over by the Red Obelisk if you want to spawn in in that area real quick. We can Hello. grab you. Yeah, hey, Neil, it looks like you were building on, um, uh, what do you call it? Herbivore Island, is that correct? Is that her voila? Yeah, yeah. Okay. The one with the little cove on it. Good. All right. Mm -hmm. Titus said you had borrowed his guy, so we're going to breed everybody up some of the basic dinos for uh, yeah, the, um, gathering and all that. <clears throat> I I made a big mistake this morning. Oh, what's that? Um, I was gathering on the island, and I accidentally hit a, like, um... One of the really big dinos, what's it called? Uh, Brontosaur, something like that. Oh, that's a mistake, yeah. Yeah, and it started attacking me, and there was two of them there, and I got killed. Right. So I ran back to get my body, and I got killed again, and I couldn't find my own bag, so... I lost everything, basically, um, including all my stored dinos. So I've only got one dino left, and it's the RG year. Oh, no. Okay. <clears throat> so Where's that gone? So those were Titus's dinos you lost, and... 
And yeah, the the one of the RGs who gave me the or oh, the other flyer and the and those silos thil or whatever they're called. Oh, right. Yeah, so I've got. Let me try and find. I'm trying to find my um, my dino. I left him here. He's vanished though. He's up on the landing deck. Oh, is he? Yep. Ah. I scooted him up there. He's at the oh, base. cool. Yeah. He's at my base right now. Uh, yeah, I got him. All right. Where you at? I'm flying around. I'm near the red obelisk. I'm going to wait for Trench and bring him in <clears throat> to the base. Mm -hmm. So, Trench, you want you want all the uh, <clears throat> basic dinos bred up for you right off the bat, or do you want to hunt for yourself? What do you want to do there? I mean, you've been playing the game enough, I you know, so you know. <laughs> yeah. You know what you want. So. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I, I don't know. Like, I, I could do either way. I'm just trying to get to the map. Like, it might be a latency issue in my household right now, because it, uh, it's searching for the session, but it's not bringing it up yet. I might have to reboot my internet if it's a problem. Okay. I'll let you know if I can get in and when, but hopefully soon. Well, let's make sure you got everything clicked right. So you got um, non-dedicated servers, right? Or is yeah, it, no, no, it's, it's, it's nothing unofficial. you guys are doing wrong. It's It's been doing this for the, the past couple of days have been like this. Oh, okay. I was going to say, if, you, if you're looking at unofficial servers, now all you got to do is type in vault and then uh, make sure that check mark is checked for... Yep. Okay, yep. gotcha. I wondered what was going on with the sound there, but I had the stream playing in the background, so everything's duplicating up. Oh, there you go. Yeah, getting the lag from the stream and all the all the speeches be is behind where it's where it is live, you know. Right. In game, <laughs> through Discord and that. Yeah, that makes it kind of weird. Yeah, it was. <laughs> I'd say something and I'd hear myself speaking a, a second later. Oh, you get the the reverb on the go. Yeah, <laughs> because I had a stream playing. <laughs> All right, there we go. Go ahead and pop out the chat. We got Comet in the house. Hey, Comet, what's going on, buddy? <clears throat> so, yeah, it looks like Hobbit finished uh, breeding up the Uteranus, so... Oh, he must have some issues. Got to reboot yeah, we got UDs that are pretty much maxed out. For now. Oh, this is a pretty bird. So we're almost back up to 10 weight. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. what I figured, Trench. Alright, man, we'll see you in a minute. <clears throat> What's the 7W guy, Hobbit? Is he uh, one to kill? The heck's this? I got something to follow him. That's Neil. Hey, Hobbit. Yep. <laughs> Neil, you're on the ground chasing me. Am I? Yeah. He's laying down chasing me. <laughs> it's hilarious. Oh, God. Which 7M are you talking about? Oh, they had the beef one, Yeah. Neil's standing upright for me. Um, yeah, you're laying <laughs> down too. That sounds like a you, that sounds like a you problem, Hobbit. <laughs> yes, someone's on drugs. It's either us or him. <laughs> what's no? What's funny is you just leaned up to look at me. and You pulled your crossbow out. It's like, <laughs> who's that? Who's at the door? Who's at the door? <laughs> you got a warrant? <laughs> <clears throat> right. Yeah, this guy right here, Hobbit. Is he dead meat? Um, I wanted to wait till the 8W grew up first. I see what you're doing. Okay, I got you. No problem. That way I don't That's a cool know. Looking bed. I, I know exactly what I'll, you're doing. I'm He's 99.8, 99. so that won't be long. Okay. All right, so we'll take him and kill him. Can I have him? Free me. You want him? Yeah, please, because I, I... Too late. Oh, ah, no. Ah, ah. We're gonna get you better. Birds, oh, so well, don't worry. All right, thank yeah, you. We got Thanks, really, man. we got really good ones that are coming up. You're gonna have ten. Yeah, I... yeah, you're gonna have ten mutations in health, weight, yep. stamina, and melee. Well, awesome. As soon as, 
as soon as this eight du eight W's ready, so I'm gonna pop them over there. You can have a fir the first few babies. When you get a baby, can I can I put him in in stasis and take him to my island to, to yeah, of course. grow him up? Yeah. yeah, they just just stop some growing up when in stasis. Yeah, when frozen. In the in the pod, yeah, they don't they don't grow. Cool. Yeah. Ah, good, my own spin. We can just take the eggs. <laughs> <laughs> but if you can't hatch them there. That's true. Yeah. I'm sure we can uh, we can set them up. Uh, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Some Demetrodons. I found an air conditioner in a drop pod, so I got one of them. That's always nice. Mhm. Mm do they help keep you cool? If, if the weather's really hot, do they help keep you cool in your base? They'll it keep does, you yeah. cool, or it they'll keep you warm. They do both. They actually condition the awesome. air both ways. Awesome. Yep. Yeah, like a proper air conditioner rather than just a, a fan. Yeah. Yeah. Like you got fur <laughs> on you. at my base. You got to be dying right now. Yeah, and I um, I lost all my armor, so I knocked some cheap. I knocked some out. Knocked some out quick. If you come in here, you probably feel a lot better. Hmm. All the ACs. I'm not hot, actually. I could do I could do some some armor as well, because I lost all. I literally lost everything on me. All right, we'll get you Just more stuff. All my tools, my weapons, um, armor. <laughs> but I was mostly gutted about losing the dinos. So. Uh, yeah. What happened? Gameplay. I'm I'm at your base here now myself. I'm just looking around at everything that's. Yeah, it's the only creature everywhere. <laughs> it's, it's making me crazy, dude. <laughs> making me crazy. Yeah. If you got like half an hour free sometime, can you teach me about breeding and stuff? Oh yeah. We we um. I know we wouldn't even know where to begin, but yeah, we could do that. <laughs> so it's not that hard. What do you need? You need you need a beaver. You need an ankin. You need a thylo, yeah. right? You're gonna need thylo. Get... What's the thylo? Oh yeah, that's that's the one. That is that the one Hobbit's riding now? Yep. I'm not riding I'm one on right it. now. I'm on it, yeah. Sorry, beefy, yeah. So Yeah, and I lost two it yeah, I lost that, so yeah, I could could do with one of them. Or two if possible. <laughs> and I think gameplay you need some upgraded uh thylas, don't you? Yeah, I, I'm still using the the older ones, but uh, like I said, they still work fine for me. Yeah. I learned a big lesson. Don't take all your dinos out when you go. Oh god no. No, <laughs> I'm no, not no. I'm not in any hurry. I can come over and, and, and bring Yeah, Dodicris, I got the Theries, I got the Dodes, and the Beavers all breeding, so... Oh, question I was going to ask. If if a dino's fighting something really out of its league, how do you stop it? You can whistle it passive, and then whistle it follow and lead it away. Um, yeah. Try to freeze it in a cryopod. Um, yep. You know, go in with a different dino, try to get the dino distracted onto something else. Mm -hmm. A lot of different okay. stuff, but everything that we're bringing pa up should be pretty tough <laughs> and and be able to kill everything pretty much. Yeah, because yeah, you, you reset the server around 7 a.m. your time, don't you? I don't ever reset the server. I very rarely reset the server, I should say. Oh, because it, it's happened a few a few days now. It's happened Saturday and this morning, 11 o'clock my time, <laughs> so that'll be seven yours. Oh, it could be yeah. an automatic uh, thing. Uh, it's yeah. A, it's an it's a arc thing, not a beef thing. Right, got you. Yeah, our maps yeah. have been reset many times. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's not right. the maps, it's the fact that he, like, he'll be playing and he'll get kicked off, right? Yeah, and I end up having to go back a bit. Yep. Oh. Yeah. That's an arc thing. All right, Hobbit, so listen, we're going to yeah. do three, you. three each of all those uh, creatures, okay? And then six each, or maybe eight each of the thylas. And it's how do you do the um, how do you do the mutations then? The mutations take time. I'll I'll sit. I'll have to sit with you one on one and go over that with you. Yeah, cool. Hey, comment. So the PS Five price has gone down. You said, huh? What are we looking at? I haven't heard that yet. So I want to get a second one for the kid. We got trench back yet? He's gonna be happy if getting a PlayStation Five. Yeah, he was happy with the four, uh, four pro. So I'm gonna mix. I'm gonna get rid of this for um, I'm gonna make some, uh, just some hide or something like that. Keep him going. Yeah, make yourself a basic yeah. set of hide. Yeah, 
You don't have any extra high primary kicking around here? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Pardon? Do. Yeah, you know what? Come, <laughs> come here, Neil. What's that? I got a whole box full of crap. And once you're feeling a little more steady on your feet, we can build you some real, real good hide. Yeah, that was... So... Yeah, because, um... They weren't, I don't think they were too high level, but they hit like a train, those things, don't they? Yeah, they like what? The here you go. Theories? Anything you need out of this box here. Armor, weapons. I don't know if I got a full set of anything, but you can mix and match. You just look like a homeless guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I missed my Goodwill outfit. I know. Hobby used to look like he robbed a Goodwill. <laughs> I just creatures everywhere. <laughs> I know, man. My home is... My home is... full... of creatures. I'm gonna move to the snow. <laughs> <laughs> so why are you breeding up... Oh, I don't know. I guess it doesn't really matter. The, uh, oh, God. I am gonna look really weird, because I got... There's... There's, um... Ghillie the gauntlets what? in here. Oh, yeah. breeding, gonna... Why are you breeding up the aloes? Gonna have flowers Me. coming out of my, my yarn oh, pits. Yeah, why though? Do you need them for something, or we just just do something to the um tech cave? Yeah, tech uh, cave. <clears throat> They're gonna be real good for the tech cave. Four hundred instead of four forty nine. I'll have to look into that comment. Thanks. Your internet's not even giving you one megabyte of the twelve hundred. What? Oh man. Who do you use, Trench? Yeah, that figures. <laughs> Yeah, we're, we're going to use a combo of Rexes and uh, Aloes in the Tech Cave. And uh, if we get these, if we get all of them in there, they're going to hit like a Mack truck. Oh, yeah, yeah. The, the Aloes are a little easier to maneuver. The Rexes are just so big and You can bring, what, 50 in there? You can bring 50 creatures, yeah. 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 Pretty much like, you, you know, we get 10 per man going in there. Oh, hey, people, mm -hmm. How many people can go in there at one time? I think we can get 10 max in, so. 10 people? Yeah. Okay. So it's going to, having more people is going to make that so much easier. Yeah, yeah, because then we got to like, have like <clears throat> follow like 10 of each guy, each yeah. person. Soloing that thing is awful. Not because of the difficulty. I mean, it is partially the difficulty, but then it's just the maneuvering and everything. It's like, oh my God. Yeah, get the ring down there. Yeah, it's awful. Soon you will get a PS5 and play AFA. <laughs> I think you have AFA. I have AFA too. You getting bored of this now? <laughs> I'm ready for Scorched Earth, man. <clears throat> <laughs> and no, uh, Mike Tyson played AFA. <laughs> <laughs> I, I pity the food. No, oh, that's Mr. T. Oh, yeah. He's better. <laughs> Mike Tyson is. That's ludicrous. Mike, yeah. Mike, if you're out there watching, I do that with love. Yeah. <laughs> we, we we have no issues, man. We have no beef. We cool. <laughs> we cool. <laughs> yeah, they kill all of us. <laughs> I wonder what he's saying. No beef. But beef. But beef. We're got the same beef. Got beef with everybody. We're the same punch. Yeah. <laughs> Hobbit says you're lame, but otherwise we're cool, bro. <laughs> I hope you do there, Comet. That'd be great. Do my little weekend on um, <coughs> Clearwater. Did a little hunting around the internet. I like uh, Mr. T's other name in the, in the uh, Rocky. Clubber Lang. Clubber <laughs> Lang. No, yeah. or was that was a Hulk with Thunderlips? Oh yeah, yeah, that was Hulk Hogan. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's yeah, a great movie, man. Clover Lang was uh, an interesting opponent. I'll have to see if Trench can get back in or if his internet is just going to crap out on him tonight. If his internet craps out, we will <clears throat> just go. Well, we'll get that stuff bred up and we'll go hunting. Otherwise, we'll try and get him. The only the on only board. way you could have made the only way you could have made. Uh, Rocky three any better <laughs> was uh, putting Randy Savage in it. Yeah. 
<laughs> Randy Savage has been in everything. Spider-Man. Skyrim. <laughs> All right. Comet's buying a PS5 just to annoy you, Hobbit. <laughs> That's dedication. <laughs> that is. It's nice to know I had that effect on people, right? Last week, last week I got people calling for my band. Now I've got co now I've got <laughs> comment come to troll me. <laughs> Devin free in people's head. Yep. Hobbit's getting himself a fan base of haters. Uh oh, Hobbit, there's a. Uh... Start monetizing oh, okay. him. I'm saying there's a couple of thylas having sex on my landing pad, but I see what's going on. Never mind. Mm -hmm. Why am I not surprised you have a van? <laughs> <laughs> well, what, are you, what else are you going to live in down by the river? Oh, you're talking about me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what's funny is I, when I first started working at Olive Garden Beef, I used to drive my dad's nine-passenger van. I remember that because all the girls that worked there were like, I think he's a serial rapist murderer. I was like, no. I said, I don't think serial, maybe just occasional. Yeah. <laughs> Part time, yeah. It's more of a hobby, not a career. <laughs> yeah. Just looking into it. <laughs> just the weekends. Bank holidays. Yeah. Yeah. He's trying to figure it out. Everybody's got to find Yeah. Out. I'm calling. Yeah, everyone's got to have a hobby. Oh, man. I want to make a, a sign that said free candy yeah. and put it, on, put it in one, one of the windows, but everybody at work told me that they, they'd report me if I did. <laughs> no, the sign's supposed to say, pet my puppy for some free candy. Yeah. <laughs> Drop the Jolly Ranchers and step away from the sandbox. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, this is deteriorating quickly. All right, so. Hmm. Yeah. We're headed towards demilitarization material. <laughs> we already been speaking there a long time of, ago, man. Speaking of deteriorating quickly, how's the pain in your office? Oh, man, <laughs> bad. So Hobbit comes to visit me at lunchtime yesterday, right? Or his yep. lunch break, and I dropped a relationship-ending fart. While he was in there, now, this, oh, thing, wow. this thing was bad. I was like both proud and ashamed it at the same smelled, time. I was like, man, it smelled like a dead yeah. body. I was like, I'm embarrassed it's, everyone's here, and I wish there was like 30 more people to share this with. I'm like, this is amazing. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta get up in the egg and cabbage curries, mate. Oh man. So he's like, I'm getting out of here, and as he leaves, he busts a huge fart and walks out the door. And I'm like, you son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I can still taste that combination. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, dear. There's yellow tape on my office nobody, till nobody, today. <laughs> Crime scene. Yeah. <laughs> no, nobody's ever seen pride and shame mixed together so beautifully. <laughs> oh, I was like, man, that part was awful, but my God, it was good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You bang your head on it, yeah? Oh. If I could have bottled that one up. They got they got they got the <laughs> morgue over there looking for a dead body. Yeah. It'll probably eaten through the glass. Well, there's a cadaver in there, I know it. I can smell it. I'm gonna start bottling them up like that one cam girl did. Remember her? Oh god, yeah. Yep. Bottling farts oh, and selling them on the internet. I mean my god. And she like had to force herself so much that she made herself sick and had to go to the hospital. I'm like, I wouldn't even have to force, man. I'm like, guy, guys, we could do that. Yeah. It all comes natural, man. Yeah. I'll make some chili, have a month's supply ready to go. Chicken, man. Cheese, Chicken. beer, and chili, I tell yeah. you what. It, 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 it won't stop until 2027. <laughs> Nothing worse than old protein farts, man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you have your own little climate change yeah, going on around you, yeah? <laughs> yeah, the climate sure changed. It turned hostile. That's it. <laughs> there was a comedian out there that was like, yeah, there's only one way to get by nine. Get a bunch of fat dudes feeding che nothing but cheer cheese and beer for a month and send them into every cave. No oh. surrender within a week. Come on. 
Really, I'm stuck? Okay. I'm not laying down anymore, dead calm. Thank goodness. Woohoo! You look, you look like Assassin's Creed over here. What the heck's going on here? That's good, ain't it? <laughs> You're in the wrong yep. game. You still trying to get on there, Trench? What do you think? A shiny head helps, yeah. Let's <laughs> see, no Hobbit has a shiny head. Oh, you saw the Megacon. <laughs> I finally found out found out how to delete that one video though, I'll be honest. Which video? The one on my uh the one on my page where I was reacting to one of your uh your videos. Oh. <laughs> so I was trying to figure out how to make shorts, I was like, okay, guess this is how you make shorts. I'm like, what? And that wasn't that I'm like, dang it, how do you delete this thing? Oh I yeah, think, yeah. Going to I manage think, videos. I think, I think gameplay. Then gameplay found it, and so did yeah. comment. <laughs> gameplay said I was handsome, and uh, comment threatened to uh, cancel my entire page. Reported <laughs> <laughs> to the same. Erased me from it. Erased me. Erased me from the internet. It's the first time someone's picture was called hate speech. <laughs> <laughs> is still laying down on the ground. Am I? And, well, and, 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 and he looks like he's flicking in and out of existence. Thomas says, I did? Uh, I wouldn't be surprised. See him Thomas. running around. Is it a wonky connection, maybe? Might be. Could be. I mean, if Hobbit's seeing multiples of us laying down and we're not seeing each other laying down, then that kind of lends me to believe it's on his end. Yeah, it could be. I'm no, I think it's could, fault. I'm no internet scientist. <laughs> yeah, sounds like something sort of laggy. You, you haven't sniffed the internet gas, yeah? Yeah. I'm no internet scientist, but I did play one on TV. <laughs> so, Hobbit, did you see uh, Dave met Jordan Peterson? Dave what? Met Jordan Peterson. No. Yep, he's been wanting to meet him what? for a long time. He's got a picture with him. Yeah, his whole Benzo project that he's working on, he's working on a Benzo documentary. He um, wanted to talk to Peterson about it because Peterson's had a lot of experience dealing with people that have had Benzo addiction and stuff like that. And I believe he actually went through it himself at one point in time. What does his name sound so familiar Jordan to me? Jordan Peterson, he's the... Uh, He's the Canadian guy. He's a teacher that uh, you know, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. in your room and all that. Everybody, and um, all the right people hate him. He uh, he uh, yeah. Yeah. went to Daily Wire or something like that. Did he work with the Daily Wire? I heard something about that. Yeah, I think he did. It was either that or Prager U. Might have been Prager U. I think it was Prager, yeah. Yeah. We got something over here getting uh, tagged by your uh, wall. Yeah, it's probably a turtle. My wall kills many. That's on that side. I was getting tagged by the spikes or by the uh, bullets. The spikes. Yeah, it's probably a, a turtle. What picture are you riding on now, anyway? Me, I'm on. Dead the Tom. Who? What is it? Ripper. It's like right behind you. Do team dinos get damaged by those spikes? Yep. Yep, they can. They can, yeah, because you haven't set it. You, you, you left it as a, a standard, yeah. What is that to your left there? I can't tell. What good are you? Could be something small. Oh, my arrows. Oh, it's a trilobite. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're not the smartest creature. 
Oh, there's a big ass sandwich. They're like, the, they're like bees. This time, this time, this time, this time. <laughs> yeah. 3.5 salmon. Nice. Jeez. Holy mackerel. 702 fish meat off that one fish. Wow, it's huge. Is it easy to fish in this? It's not hard. It's the hardest part is just getting the uh, fishing rod. That makes it worth fishing. You can build a crappy one, but you won't get anything worthwhile out of it. Right. How do you how do you craft higher level gear like ascendant stuff? Do you need a blueprints? Blueprint. I need blueprints. They're all at my base. Yeah, Hobbit's our blueprint guy. So if you ever find good blueprints, we we keep them consolidated at his base. Okay. What do you mean by good? What would that level be? Anything ascendant, ascendant is worth looking at. Anything less than ascendant yeah. is really, at this point, not worth looking at because we've got so many. Okay. You know. Awesome. Okay. So if right, I want to craft something, I'll come to your base. Is it? If the yeah, you have to get the blueprint from Hobbit's base. Yep. Mhm. Mm and then a lot of times they're real, real expensive, so we just got to make sure you get the uh, stuff for it. You know. Yeah, is it worth doing a doing a, um, a crafting potion for that? Absolutely, it is. Yep. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's almost so, consistent. Yeah. There's a pile of them at my base if you want any. Yeah, I think all of us have crafting potions, so yeah, you're welcome to use them at any base. I make a little bit. Yeah, of I don't. Go. I don't have any. Well, you can come get some any time, or just whip them up yourself. They're not that bad. Okay. Yeah, they but take, basically, yeah. Beef took the the breeding part of us. I took most. I took the cooking part of us, and Hobbit took the bullets and uh, took the blueprints. Yeah, I'm gonna have to start moving on that one. <laughs> we might have uh, somebody else take over the bullets, since Hobbit's been doing so much of the breeding here. He hasn't had a lot of time to do his other stuff. So, are we going to go look for some uh, magical horses? Yeah, let's go horse hunt. I haven't seen any yet. I've been killing everything i found, but... So, I've been finding them all along the rivers and stuff like that, and the, yeah, that's... the plains, you know. Gonna... I'm going to go uh, east along the bottom shore here and turn up the first river and see what I can see. Why wouldn't let me get on my bird? That's weird. All right, I got some. And the thing is, if you find a really, if you find one in a really crappy place, um, feel free to bring it to that little trap outside my house or somebody else's house, whatever. Yeah, I'm just gonna pick them up. Yep. Raptor, come here. I kills you. I'm actually looking forward to a refresh, yeah, to a restart. Yeah, it'll be fun going to Scorched Earth. Yeah, it will. New creatures, new... We'll be all on the same field, then. New beginnings! They Apparently there's a new cave in there now, the one that wasn't in there before, which is kind of neat. Um... When's that when's that being released? <clears throat> it's supposed to be... <laughs> Yeah, exactly. This weekend. It's supposed to be this weekend. So, New Year 2024. Five, yeah? Everybody is such a believer in It's so heartwarming. Oh, <laughs> oh I got <laughs> such faith in them. I'm picking June. June's mine. No, it's not going to be June, bro. <laughs> I don't have a lot of faith, okay. but I think they're going to at least get July. it. They're at least going to get it in this month, I think. And, and not for yeah, everybody. Been... Not for everybody, but for... Um, PC but and at least for PC. Game Pass. Oh, God. We'll have to wait a day or two on PlayStation, I'm sure. That's just that's just the way it is. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh. Is my good RG out? 
Where's my good RG? <laughs> Have you seen my RG around Hobbit? Um, Afterburner, I yeah. think he's over by the Rexes in the corner, hiding on for his beach. life. The hell, on the what beach. the hell are you doing over here, bro? Over by the crapper. And why do you have no saddle on you? Uh, I didn't do anything like that. Mm. I didn't <laughs> touch him. I knew exactly where he was, but I didn't do anything with the saddle. <laughs> no, I saw him over there when I was worrying about the, um, the Rexes. He only had a crappy saddle anyway, I'm gonna throw another one on him. Well, I'm not gonna do it, I don't, see, I don't see anything about him. Who was touching you after Burner? All right, so horse hunting. Your horse hunting, eh? Yep. I got a couple extra <coughs> pods. <clears throat> Mr. Ed, I've got to have to burn a track because it's the easiest way to get find myself to your base. I just go straight for your bird. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that works. Hmm. So I'm to keep looking at the map to make sure I'm not going the wrong way. After a while, you'll recognize the band marks. Yeah. yeah everything will start to be familiar. We'll triangulate using the uh, the big obelisks and all that. Mm-hmm. I am seeing a lot of huge coelacanth and uh, other creatures right now, other fish. I'll oh, grab the fishing pole <laughs> and a pelagornis. <laughs> Mega cereal. Now he's, uh, oh, you want to get the PS5 in three months? That'd be cool, man. Get it for summer. Just in time. Heck yeah. Are you working, bro? Heck yeah. I can't wait to. I'd say I'll be unreachable for most of the summer. <laughs> really? Yeah. Between Getting ready my, for that kid. my camper will be out. I'm a trailer out. Oh yeah. And uh, I don't see and, anything saying uh, after frozen or thrown back out. And the working on the house, I don't say I'm going to be around much. <laughs> You're right. Oh, I managed to get a massive, massive case of leeches on my Tyler and uh, myself on Saturday. Oh, yeah, that's not good. <laughs> I, I I didn't think the Thyla was going to make it, so I stuck him in, I froze him as soon as I got back to base. And uh, luckily when I defrosted him, he was clean, so. That's but my health was, it. but I ended up dying. My health ended up so low that I ended up dying. What you do is you uh, build a fire. Yep. And you step in it. Right, yeah. I didn't know why that, but and I was so worried about dying. I just if the cat dying, I didn't care about myself really. Yeah, if you and I spawned then in the wrong place. I ended up been north of your base in this massive cave. Oh, I know exactly where you spawned. <laughs> was it really cold? Yeah, yeah. I ended. I just drowned myself to get out of there. How'd you pick things up? Uh, L two. Ah, like that. Quite, it's quite easy, isn't it? Oh yeah, it's helpful. Yeah, I just got to press left mouse button instead, right mouse button instead of. Yeah. yeah so what you, you can pick up creatures and drop them in a in a cave cave for that cage. Then can you to to tame them? Yeah. Correct. Some creatures yeah. you can't grab everything with these guys, but you can grab a lot of creatures with these guys. I saw you pick up that bigfoot. Yes, was it the other day and uh, drop it in a cage outside Hobbits? Oh, yeah. yeah. Shh. I'm kidding. <laughs> I could yeah, grasp you up, you, yeah. What did he do to Kate? <laughs> I, I always drop crap in that he cage. He took, he took a big dump in it. 
I dropped a Bigfoot in your cage. He filled filled it up with with, with crap. Yeah. <laughs> you probably know it's a funny smell when you get home. Every time I fly by your base, I grab something and drop it in your cage, or I'll drop it. Ah, in, if it's completely harmless, I'll drop it in your base like a Lystra. Drop it in the base, yeah. <laughs> I mean, you're welcome to drop like big feet and everything on the outside of my base. It'll either get shot at or yeah. they're a xenode. <laughs> Trolling the uh, the Spinosaurus. Oh yeah. This is a swamp area. Stand the <laughs> Same. I had to land in the middle of the swamp too, of all things. <laughs> oh, you're going to the swamp. Well, all along these rivers, you can find horses. And what I really should do <clears throat> is chuck out my thyla and start killing everything. Mm. Is it? Is it dependent on weight, or is it type of creature that you can pick up? It's depend yes. It depends on the drag weight of the creature, yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, I can grab a big titan I bow. Grabbed a dip I grabbed a Diplo with my uh, Capizera. Yeah, because I got two and a half grand in um, weight on this thing now. Yeah, your weight won't make you grab a bigger creature. It's it's Certain creatures can be certain grabbed. Certain creatures can grab certain yeah. things. What sort of creatures can you grab then with, with this? Uh, you can grab raptors, dodicarus, ankies, um, ankies, all kinds of stuff, really. Horses. That's cool. Packies. Can't grab baryonyx, though. No. Thanks a lot, Bin Laden. Can't grab capras either. Yeah, they're really big, though, aren't they? Not really, no. But you can grab Titan Boas, you can grab uh, the Dillos, Parasaurs. Cool. Yeah, just a ton of stuff. Can they damage you when they when you've got them? Sometimes, yeah. Oh, yep. Yeah. And if you click the other mouse button while you're holding them, you should be able to damage him while you're flying around. So, like, I can grab something and kill it while I'm flying. Yeah, you can attack it, yeah. And then you can also grab really small creatures with your beak while you're flying. Like dodos and stuff that's that small. Yeah. I don't know how you would do that with a mouse, but I know with the uh, controller, it's R3. You start April mm -hmm. 5th, you start a new job April 5th? Well, cool, man. Congratulations. I hope it works out well for you. Yeah, I don't know what you'll be doing, but I mean, even at a, I mean, yeah, 450 bucks, it shouldn't be too tough to save that up if you don't have other crap you got to pay off. <clears throat> right. I don't know, you don't have any baby mamas, right, Comet? Oh, 140 <laughs> berry on it. What's that? A 140 berry. Ah. We have Is lots of berries. Pretty? Lots of berries. We're not getting it's anything pretty. other than what we need now, guys. <laughs> Once we hit yeah. scorched earth and all that, we'll, uh, you know, we'll look. My at my bird's spurging out. <laughs> What's it doing? Man. It was spurging out. Ooh. It was like looked like it was gonna stall, basically. Oh yeah, watch your stamina. Make sure you land from time to time. Ah, that'll be it. That could prove to be fatal. Yeah, I'm. I'm gonna gonna land now. Yeah, so many circles. I got. Oh yeah. She got attacked by bees, but he killed them. So. Yeah, I wouldn't mind taking the sarcos out again now that they work. <clears throat> I'm in the kind of swampy area here, so lots of uh, circles. You're kind of riding the southern beaches here. <clears throat> oh, cool, Comet. 
I just stayed on my thigh and I was running across the river. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to get on Shredder. <laughs> Can always switch out later. <clears throat> you still have a Thyla, Neil? No, I lost it. I, um, on Saturday, I was, um, right. heading up around from the east back to the base and, uh, his server timed out and I ended up in the middle of a swamp. Uh, <laughs> so uh... I was running through that and I saw this big leg, which I thought was a, a brontosaur, but it was one of those mega... Oh, it's the titanosaur. Yeah, and um, it, it completely wrecked one of my thylers. That's why I asked about getting him out of there, because I tried to get him out of there, but he wouldn't stop fighting it, and he ended up getting killed. Yeah, you can actually kill one of those with a thyla. If you want to ride Ripper, you what? can ride Ripper. We'll freeze up long haul. What's that? I said if you want to ride Ripper, you can ride Ripper. We'll freeze up long haul. Yeah, let me... Um... I think we'll be better on the ground. Awesome. Because <clears throat> if we start killing everything, then mm -hmm. new stuff will spawn in and hopefully we'll get some horses spawning in. Ah, yeah. There's only a certain amount of spawns per area, I take it, is there? Yeah, creatures share spawns with each other, you know, so... Yeah, so if there's a free slot, it's like random, is it? What spawns there next? Right. Yeah, that makes sense. Like, I think the Gigantic Raptor spawns in with the Therizino. now. That's really what it seems like to me. Was it Titanosaur? Is it like that, that huge. Yeah, it's that monster sauropod, yep. Mm hmm. Yeah, I got a couple videos on those guys just soloing them. It takes a minute, you gotta be a little careful, but. Definitely do it. Find some horses. <clears throat> this little area is always pretty good. Yeah, that's why I asked about pulling off um, when it's attacking, because like for the life of me, I couldn't get it off the uh, the Titanosaurus. Yeah, if you want to rescue it... something like that, you whistle it passive. And then you whistle yep. it follow you and get it away from there or hop on it and ride it away. Yeah, I got you. Whatever you can do. Can you get it or get it to move move to pl place? You can, but I mean, like, the, that thing's going to follow it, you know what I mean? Right. It's not very, they're not very fast, though, are they? The Thank God. Well, they can move, yeah. but yeah. They're not super duper fast, but they can move. One each. One each by spinal. Oh, really? Yeah. I will eat him. Yeah. Take his sail. Yeah, we need those sails. Should have killed that one I saw earlier. I'll go back and get him later. That's probably the same one. I'm uh, like closer to your base. Oh, are you? It might be then. Yeah. A little further south. Yeah. All right, that swamp up there. We don't want to go in the swamp. We won't find any horses there. The thylers are pretty deadly when there's a couple of them, aren't they? Oh yeah, they're they're they're. Because when I was tra when I was traveling around, I managed to take out two two rexes, and one of them was 140, and the other one like oh, yeah. 120 something. It's like yeah, and these thylers that like the one you're riding is sick. Mm -hmm. I mean, he's got a lot of mutations on him, and just set yep. Up. All right, Comet. We'll see you, buddy. Always thanks for stopping by. Later, Comet. See you later, comment. Some 
I don't think the one I got here has very many mutations on it. I think this one has uh, the wifey thumb in health. Yeah, I don't think you ever got a fully mutated one. I mean, by fully mutated, I mean 10 oh. and 10. You want to have revenge on a couple of the big guys? Let's go get them. Yeah, come on. Yeah, your, your, your cousin murdered me. Twice. <laughs> Time to die. I said I've killed hundreds of Rexes with this oil. God, oh, they, they yeah. kick like a mule, don't they? Yeah, my Thyla is not afraid of anything. Yeah. Mini, mini Alpha Raptors. Oh god, yeah, Alpha Raptors. The only thing that really gives it a run for its money is a Giga. And, um... An Alpha Rex, oh, if it's really high level. And a couple of alpha, an alpha Rex, or even a couple of Alpha Rex is usually... Yeah. ...give it a hard time. Now, if the Alpha Rex is solo, it's not too bad. No, no, no. But if it's got a bunch of crap with it, I mean, like a, a real pain. Like 150 Alpha Rex. Yeah. Base over here. Uh, you down south? The that's field? probably Titus's. Yep. Oh, Titus's. That's yep. You like it? What's your What's your thing called, Beefy? Your Thyla. I am on Shredder. You're on Ripper. Yeah, let me let me. I'm gonna track Shredder so I know I, I don't lose track of you. All right. Two I think seconds. I found the fridge in the stove that was at the other base. <laughs> Oh, really? Yeah, okay. I made those myself. Oh, did you? <laughs> yeah. Uh. Yeah, I don't care. Anybody wanted to take whatever from that base. No, that base no, was no. Where was that to? The original base? Mm -hmm. It was in like a little uh, inlet. A little outcropping out or incropping or whatever it is at the. I guess that the. Uh, Halfway across the map on the south, the map. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that was an abandoned base there, was it? Yeah, yeah. That was. Oh, because oh, I we found got a horse. We got a horse. Hold on, don't, don't attack. I'm not going to. That's a level thirty. Because I, because I raided it. Oh, you, you're the one. Okay, oh, you raided. Okay. Yeah, okay. I because it was definitely abandoned. There, half the things were broken. There was nothing there. So I thought are, oh, uh... nobody wants that. So I, I nicked the nicked the components. For mine. Yeah, that was our original starter base. Yeah. Yeah, it's not very productive there. There was a, there's nothing there. No, no, no. There's, oh yeah, we had already got it. I was I was considering to um, move there, but there was no trees or anything close, or even even decent rocks to harvest. You have to kind of go out from there to get that stuff, but yeah. Yeah. Yeah, on on the Tib Island, there's loads of trees, loads of rocks, and there's actually about a thousand iron as well. Yep. Yeah, the only thing you're missing out there is crystal and obsidian. Yeah, but um, and you don't need a ton it's of not to start. No, no, you don't. Well, what I'm going to do when I, if I get another bird, I'm going to take a couple of them up to the, you know, um, one of the mountains and fill them both up with crystal and obsidian. I got a 100 Equus. Yeah, there's a Anki up on top of the. Lava <laughs> volcano, and he's uh, always full. Hitting the metal. I'm glad that talking about, out. um, talking about Thanks. Flint? Yeah. That's a good name. Yeah, that's my dude. <laughs> that's a good I've, name. I've helped him, I've relieved him of some material a few times. Oh, yeah, we've all hit Flint up. Uh huh. That was our idea, Beef. Leave them up there. Yeah. Yeah, that one actually worked out. The one I put on Herbivore Island did not. Oh, there's two of them over there. Yeah, I don't ever see anything on them. I don't know if you guys have seen anything on them, but I never What's that? A couple of Ankies on Herbivore Island running loose.
Anki, is that like the armor play one with spikes? Yeah. And a yeah. club tail. Because I was, I first time I arrived there, I had one. F it's following you. <laughs> <laughs> so I adopted it. I didn't know who it belonged to. Is there anywhere you can check? Um, yeah. Yeah. When you look at it, you'll be able to see if it was raised. It'll say raised by a Hobbit or ah, whatever. You. Imprinted by. Now, it's but it's also one of the. It's, yeah, it was it was called something like um, Smasher or something like that. Yeah, that was one of mine. I threw over there. That's oh. a 130. Yeah, like I say, I adopted it, but I ended up... Oh, come on. 145 series. I, I can't move. What's going on? You're just stunned. Give oh, a second. I'm, I'm stunned. Yeah, but it's one of the ones I lost as well this morning. So, easy come, easy go away. Yeah, yeah it's weird. That it's like... I can't remember being to the island before, but then when I'm there, there's a dinosaur following me. It's like, that's weird. Did you swim across, way across the ocean? But I must have gone there before, before and done a follow-all or something. Maybe. Yes. That's nice, uh, there, you know? Really? Right there. Oh, oh, oh. I see a horse, I see a horse. What do we got, what do we got? 75 unicorn. Ah. Nice. <laughs> Unicorn. I'm so sorry. Kill him. <laughs> I'm so sorry. No. You kill the unicorn, you're going to hell for sure now. I know, I watch Legend. <laughs> <laughs> now it's going to be an Age of Darkness. <laughs> yeah. Where are you guys at? I'm near oh, the Green Hobbles. Just basically killing everything that can be killed. If you put a track on Shredder, you'll be able to, or whatever mine's called, you'll be able to find it. Oh, ooh, level up. What do you want me to level this one up for? He's getting melee only. Melee, is it? Yep. Yeah, he should be getting close to 1200 melee. Yeah, eleven hundred. Two hours. Oh, trench. Well, we just got to save your big debut for Thursday then. <laughs> At least now you know uh, everything to get in, and you can, you know, you got all the mods downloaded and all that crap. So that's that's good. But yeah, that sucks. You talking trench? Yeah, I use Xfinity too, and you know they they were a little hit and miss in the beginning with me, but they only got better. And I'm pretty happy with them now. But we got a... We got something we got to fight across the way here. An Alpha Raptor. On the wrong side. Here it is. Alpha Raptor, yeah. That'll get you some levels, maybe. I stopped off on top of a mountain a bit north of, um, oh, it's not gameplay, what's, what's it? The mm -hmm. guy who's got a base about halfway, uh, yeah, this, um, Hobbit, Hobbit, no, dead calm. Oh, oh yeah, he's down south here a little bit. That's yeah, north of his base, there's a mountain top with about 1200 iron on it, so I stopped off there, ended up with the flipping an alpha raptor after me. Uh, Luckily, I managed to get back on my bird as he was as he was chewing my ass off. <laughs> yeah. One thing this game will teach you is to always check yep. your surroundings before you dismount. Uh huh. Two freaking yep. animals. I had two raptors outside my base and kill me. Um, just before we started. I yeah. didn't check my surrounding. I walked out to the front door. That's silly. Yeah, Especially when you live in the wrong neighborhood. Yeah, there's nowhere safe here. Yeah. No. Ark is like a democratic city. You just, you're nowhere safe. 
Fuck yeah. It's like... It's, it's like Portland. <laughs> in, oh, you Portland in... Yesterday... Rock. Yesterday I was putting out that... Um, bridge and grill and there is a Therizino outside. 135. There's a lot of Therizinos oh. in the game now. Yeah. Hey, little baby. On three. Uh, where do we go from here? Apparently, if you kill the, the parent, you can adopt, you can tame the baby with a, just just by. Yeah, just by claiming it. Claiming it, yeah. Sometimes you get extra levels for it, like you do when you tame a creature. Sometimes you don't. Mm -hmm. And we have tried everything to figure out what does it, and the closest we could figure was random. Yeah. Just random. That, that makes sense. If it's um, a free dino, then it's probably going to be random, isn't it? Yeah. Hmm? Yeah, I just got a text for some. I just ate a bunch. That one just walked into your mouth. Yeah. Yeah, you want to be eating? Okay, come here. I was killing going down now. I had to get, get off the, my thylo to get the bag. I don't know where a uh, Trudon went after me. Oh, you know they're always waiting. Oh, uh, what? <laughs> I'm going down the old river next to the old base. Ah, uh, okay. I just went through and cleaned that area up, so hopefully. Oh, there's lots of creatures down here. <laughs> yeah, hopefully uh, something spawned in. Yeah, the Alpha Raptors down here. <laughs> Try to fight you. Who was that little duck? No, the piggies. Alright, let's go ahead Prime horse country. Yeah, it looks looks like um, pasture. Hey Beef, can you give us two minutes to go and get a coffee? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, I'll just... Won't be long. Coffee sounds good. Coffee sounds good. It does, actually. <laughs> I love a good I just coffee. Think it's... <laughs> yeah. trench yeah the only real good option for internet out here is Xfinity everything else is pretty much garbage in uh, my county there's no way to get fiber you hey central link I say you don't have no fiber there have you no we don't have fiber if we have fiber I would probably get it no no probably I would get it definitely get it yeah yeah come here Colonel yeah I'd sacrifice like whatever Colonel. I had to to get it yeah. Who needs electricity? No, I'm kidding. I used to kill like 30 true downs. <laughs> All my bones are broken. I'm poisoned. Oh no. I hear 
hear something killing something else, but I'll look first. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, I've seen a few horses, but nothing worth taming yet. Best was a level 100. But at least they're spawning in tonight. Hobbit and I were looking for him the other night, and they were not spawning in at all. Oh, wow, I'm glitching. What's going on? My side is climbing a wall. I'm about to hit the ceiling cap. Oh, oh crap. Yeah. That happens. Crap, Just drop them down. Yeah. Hey. I'm so overweight. <laughs> what do I have on me? A lot of meat. <laughs> yeah, I just threw out so much meat. I'm like 5,000 uh, hide, too. I have 5,000 hide on me. What's for dinner? 3,000 meat. <laughs> so, playing that Cult of the Lamb, Chris was playing it. He, he's uh, he's funny, oh. man, because he's like kicking my ass in there right now, but I don't have the time he has for it, you know? And he's like, uh, talking about sacrificing cultists and I was like, I don't sacrifice mine I chop them up for meat and feed them to the rest of the cult he's like, ew <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh yeah <laughs> that's how we roll yeah they don't call me Dharma for nothing mm. <laughs> oh man we let nothing go to waste here <laughs> But what a goofy little fun game. Yeah, like that guy in um, California. Did you see that? And there's a guy who's hit by a train and got dismembered. This homeless dude walked up, picked up his leg, and started eating it in the street. In California. Definitely California, yeah. I don't even... They don't call it the home. The land of fruits and nuts. I don't even <laughs> doubt it for a moment. That is gross as hell, though. Holy cow. It's on... They got it on, picked on camera. Yeah, it's like, dear God. California is such a failure. Uh huh. Definitely a Biden voter, yeah. Level one raptor. Was trying to get his level one. You found a level one raptor? I just killed us. Yeah. I found a level one something the other night. I don't know what happened there. Yeah, you said level five supposed to be the minimum, isn't it? Yeah. And everything should be in increments of five. Now, occasionally you might find a baby. That has some mutation, so it'll have two extra levels on it. Mm -hmm. But otherwise, yeah, everything should be fives. And here's the spino. Spine is useful for anything? Yep. Yeah, they're good for uh, fight the broodmother with that. We have an alpha around here somewhere. Oh, I see it. Alpha no more. Yeah, right. The alpha's a beta. <laughs> Man. So yeah, I don't know. Um, I don't know exactly what happened with that bridge in Baltimore. You know, he got you, hit by a right. hit by a boat. Big some, some sort of ship. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just waiting to find out the name of the woman that was driving the boat. Yeah. <laughs> Probably Tunisia. <laughs> well that, that that guy that guy in the Suez Canal has lost his record as the worst world's worst pilot, yeah? Oh, oh yeah. But what a mess, man. Well 
I bet somebody had a bad night after doing that. <laughs> I'm so screwed. Oh my god, I'm so screwed. Tell your kids you'll see them in 30 years, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, that's really shutting off a big port and all that. It's going to be some repercussions. Oh, God, yeah. There's your base right there's across seven, the waterfront still, here. There's still seven people missing. Still seven? Yeah. Was the sea uh, running across on the other side over there? <laughs> might be us. I'm glad it it's happened at one something yeah, in the morning me. and not at it like eight in the morning or something like that. Oh, yeah, I know. God, imagine if I had rush hour. Yeah, it could be hundreds of people down there. Yeah, the, you know, the charge could have probably been backed up. Somewhere in England, there's a bunch of people who are saying, Thank God you take chance out of the news finally. <laughs> God. Thank God what? <laughs> the Titanic's out of the news. <laughs> yeah. Oh, here's another <laughs> alpha. Um, I heard Cameron wants to do a uh, sequel. Yeah. Was this planned? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, false flag. Jack's back. <laughs> Jack's back and he's looking for vengeance. Yeah, anything to get people, anything to stop people talking about immigration. <laughs> yeah, they couldn't get Leonardo DiCaprio to well, come back because the film's old, over the, you know, more than 25 years old, so. <laughs> yeah. Now we're up here. Kill this guy. Rose is a granny, and he he, he won't touch him. Yeah. Yeah, he's They're pretty fierce, those things, aren't they? Are oh, those little bastards? Oh, yeah. yeah. What, grannies? Defense are going to run back. Yeah. Also, one fifty, do. They don't want anything to take. Oh, yeah, you can run, but you can't hide. Yeah. 135. What's that? 135. Aloe. No. Uh, we got a lot of aloes. I just killed Yeah. I just killed, I just killed 150. You know, find out the uh, ocean liner driver was an uh, immigrant. Yeah. Definitely a diversity hire. It was considered by uh, Delta, but decided to make them all. Well, the Not too much experience, yeah. Yeah, the conspiracy theory around it is that it was a cyber attack because if you watch the footage, the lights go off on the boat briefly, then it steers into the thing and the lights come back on and it hits. So. That's a cyber weird. attack, you say? Yeah. That's what, that's what it takes for this, yeah. I was going to say, well, hackers can clap bridges now. Bloody hell, they're talented, didn't they? Well, if you think, about, some the, hacking if you think about the computer systems on on everything anymore, mm -hmm. like just imagine these uh, these smart cars mm -hmm. and these fully just automated cars. Just look out cars. the window. Like, imagine somebody yeah, hacking into them and just forcing them all to go crazy. You know, I think I it's saw like that, that guy who drove he drove he drove into a river, and it's like, well, well, the GPS told me to go that way. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What did your eyes say to tell you to do? Yeah. Yeah. But the brain didn't let you know that you were stupid, did it? <laughs> no, it didn't. Just too right. stupid to realize, yeah? <laughs> Imagine being only just smart enough to realize you're really stupid. <laughs> Eventually, they're going to hack into all these air traffic controllers and make planes fly into each other. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, there's so much potential out there. That you know, it's just so many bad things can be done with the some brave That's new world. That's what happens when you rely too much on technology and not enough on your own, on your own ingenuity. Yeah, or even your own common sense. I'm waiting for these days that they're gonna take over all those nuclear power plants and have it melt down. Yeah, I mean we've got a generation now that was raised with computers and social media, Google, Google Maps, and all that their entire life. And they're so reliant on technology, they don't know how to go outside. Yeah, they'll, they yeah. won't, like, you know, yeah. 
they won't know how to deal with something like you know, oh, the GPS is down. How do we find our way to New York? Well, you follow I-95 <coughs> north, and then you follow the signs when you get close. Yep. Yeah, see one of those... Uh, you look at a map. Yeah, the map's on my GPS. Yeah. One of those memes, right? You can tell that... Uh, my phone doesn't you know, have internet anymore. I can't find my way to New York. <laughs> I know, yeah. Paper map, and it Just shows... Just go right? north. <laughs> It's like like the people who think who think that food comes from supermarkets. Oh my goodness! I saw that. I was like, "Oh, you poor thing." <laughs> I know. What was the paper map mean? You like like a um, you can whatever it is like a, this generation has never has never used a paper map and it shows. Oh mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Man, I used to use those all the time while I was in Ontario. Oh, hell yeah, and, and an that... atlas. <laughs> you always had an atlas yeah, in your right. car. Always. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. When I was moving to Pennsylvania back in 2007, we were using um, a paper map and printed maps from uh, from AAA. Yeah. yeah, I couldn't afford an actual atlas. I was like. Or I we 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 had we we had we had a uh, a uh, U.S. map and then we also had the uh, stuff that AAA gave us. Yeah, one of the I first things I, I got after I bought my new first car was a a pro, a pro full atlas. I had that you paper know? map you pull out the hood and fold the lid and tie of your hood. Oh, <laughs> oh you God, yeah, when fold it correctly. Yeah, that yeah, was what I used to use. <laughs> I tried driving across the highway. We just unfolding that and trying to see. Oh yeah, going. yeah. They're worried about the guys <laughs> drinking and driving. Be worried about the guys trying to use this freaking map while he's driving. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, that oh, French sorry, guy man. passed on on the motorway reading a book. He had a book on a. He had a book on his um on his steering wheel. <laughs> driving down, driving down the M1. God. I saw a funny little thing one time. The guy was talking about how they focus so much on guys drinking and driving is you should focus on the guys eating and driving. When you're eating and driving, you're just trying to eat your hamburger. When you're drinking and driving, you're focused on driving. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, give us some more horses. How's your internet tonight, Beef? What's that? How's your internet tonight? It seems okay. There's something wrong on your end? No, so just it's a scenic performance from off from me, but wasn't that bad. Yeah, I'm not having any issues tonight. No. I've had a couple it, of minor glitches, awesome. but well, I've got sort of lag when I've been jumping around, when teleporting a little bit, but that's that stopped ages ago. Where's your server based? Uh, New this York? is New York, New York City. Mm -hmm. New York City. A four feet, my kitty. Are you? Yeah, he's full now. Neil's been, Neil's been running around with me, so the uh, bonus has kept my guy pretty healed up. You get a bonus, do you? Yeah, you, you see how we have hearts over us? Yeah, that's a mating bonus. So if you have a male and a female of the same creature, mm -hmm. you get a mate boost, which gives you uh, a little extra damage dealt and a little damage mitigation when you take a hit. That's why you want to always try to have a mate boost when you're with other people. <laughs> it, it's, it is that good. I think it's what, 10 to 25 percent? Yeah, I don't remember the exact percentage, but it's significant. That's good. And it works the opposite way, too. If you're fighting against two Rexes and they're a male and a female, they're going to have a mate boost, so they're going to take a little less damage and deal a little bit more damage, so... It's always best to kill the weakest of the two first, and then the other one will drop pretty quick afterward because it'll lose those bones. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
We might have enough people to take on that water cave now. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it was a, num a number, it was just a space. <laughs> it's it's, it's, it's out of the mega spawning cave you're on about. Yeah. As soon as we're done with those basils, I'm getting a super car. Super what? Mega super down. Charge. Oh, yeah. Well, I'll tell you what. Get, get us some bonuses in melee and health. That's all we need. Even in just Jenkins. even in just health would be good, because these guys mm -hmm. are sick in melee. And I don't care if we have to fill that whole freaking thing with sharks. <laughs> it would be just keep throwing them out at them, right? Just are coming. Just keep throwing yeah. them out at them. Put them all on. Uh, put them all on aggressive. aggressive. And just throw them out there. Yeah. All, oh, look a shark. Speaking of sharks. <laughs> Oh yeah, I remember not to go underwater this time. Yeah. I'll try not to drown. Yeah, don't drown. There we go. Killed so many Fiomia. <laughs> hey, that's a silly move. You didn't want to go doing that. God, they're fast, aren't they? Oh, yeah. They're the worst when you're on foot early game. They're, yeah. They're like the um, the ones in Jurassic Park where they get swarmed. Mm -hmm. Those little lizards. Is it the second one yet? The little copies, yeah. yeah. Those are the first ones that killed me when I first <laughs> started my game. Uh-oh. Oh, what? Piss these guys off. Who's the ones that spit poison? Was it a Dillos? Dillos. That was yeah. Jurassic Park 1. With yeah, I, Dennis I, I, Madry. I got killed a couple of times by them when I started uh, off. Ah, uh, you didn't say the magic word. Yeah, those guys will kill you a few times. <laughs> yeah. What magic was that? Yeah, uh, uh, uh. The password. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. In the movie. Yeah. <laughs> I see. Yeah, that, that's still funny. Go, keep going back to that short me. What's the magic word? The Rex is behind you, yeah? <laughs> you're watching that Dill come after me. He's like, you're like, ha ha ha. <laughs> Turns around and says, oh, we have, we have a watcher. <laughs> yeah. Voyeurism, eh? Come that on, was hilarious. That was a 152, that... wasn't it, of all things? I don't remember. I don't have much luck on horses, man. I found a few early on. Oh. Yeah, they were low level, though, weren't they? Yeah. You got all the way over to the green obelisk over here now. Is that where you are? I'm over there now, too, pretty much. <laughs> I'm going the green up, obelisk up too. River from that. Well, I'm on the swamp side of it. You know, you can head north through gameplays. I don't think they spawn up there, though, really. And we've seen them kind of along the river in front of your base, haven't we, Hobbit? Yeah. I've even seen them up next to my base. Horses? Every now and again. Okay. You'll see one across. Like, even seen sheep. They're from time to time. I see these fellows. Now you're on the other side of the river. Yeah, they're both kind of like luck of the draw because they're so easy to kill them. Yeah. And the dinos love fighting each other, don't they? Oh yeah. <laughs> Look at that. Hey. Unload. What made that thing think that was a smart move? <laughs> yes. <clears throat> I was thinking with the little head. <laughs> 
There's a dragonfly. It only has a little head. But there's nothing wrong with a little head. All right, <laughs> we'll move on. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Honey. <laughs> so what do you guys think? You like that kind of news style videos and all that? Or do you think I should, you know? Yeah, pretty good. You like that? All right. I'm trying to break into that a little bit. I think that might be uh, more fun. I enjoy the investigation and looking around and all that. Like the one about the Soros thing was, you know, it wasn't like reporting on an article or anything. I was just like, oh, wait a minute. When I looked into her connections and all that, I was like, oh, I got something here. That's kind of cool. What did you hear back afterwards? Hmm? Did you hear anything else back afterwards? Not yet, no. I'm enjoying the demise of Kotaku, by the way. Yeah? Oh, yeah. Now if we can just get the gamer next, and there's a couple others out there. Oh, God, yeah. PC gamer, yeah? Yeah, no, the gamer. As well. Yeah, the gamer is horrible. PC gamer is well named, though, isn't it? Yeah. Looked like he was swinging that thing around by the tail. <laughs> Come on, man. Where's the horses? Wow. Where you come? Do the bugs come out at night, or...? No, yeah, they do. It's just one... They're all gone. Yeah. They don't really have a nocturnal creature other than the Megalosaur, but that's a cave-dwelling creature, and it's not that he comes out at night, it's just he's active at night. I think it'd be kind of cool if some of the creatures were diurnal and nocturnal, you know? Kind of neat. Mm -hmm. That's like a missed opportunity. I thought they made uh well Trudons are kind of nocturnal in a way. They're out either way, but at not at nighttime they're more aggressive, yeah. Mm hmm Missed him. But I guess then they'd have to figure out a way to have the creature sleeping and knowing gamers we would just abuse that as far as taming goes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, we got four of us now here? Oh, this is crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this poor area is going to be decimated. Kill everything. Salt the earth. God, this is... This is tough. It's a level 80, but it's taking ages to die. What is it? One of those big, um... Turtles. Spiky turtle things. Oh, yeah. Terrible. They got, they got a lot of health. What yep. it is. They do. Yep. Yeah. And they load of armor as well. Oh, we got two. We got packy rhino babies over here. Nice. Delicious. Oh, give me a sec. My stamina's gone down. I'm going to have to stop for a little bit. Alright. Oh, that's jumping up quick. He's eating like a son of a bitch. Yeah, so. 
Just a matter how it. Whoa, one hit kill. Oh, yeah. Love the way you can jump up and bite, bite the birds in midair. Yeah, that's always fun. <laughs> yeah. Like the train on, you can just jump and get him that one last time or cause that blood bleeding to kill him. How are you trying to tame Packies? Thank you, Rhinos. No. Hobbit's murdering the babies again. <laughs> I, want, I want to see if I can get levels on them. I killed the mom. Just pack, I looked, pa I, packing around on babies. Yeah, I looked at the log the other morning. And it's like, um, so, 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 baby so and so killed by Hobbit. Something killed by Hobbit. Killed by Hobbit. Killed by Hobbit. Oh, that's when you're breeding. Okay. You're going to see a lot of that yeah. breeding. Yeah. And I was like, He's on a I'll rampage, do, I'll eh? do Elvis's a lot just to get the extra meat back. Yeah, and if they're not, just I, if you breed them and their they're stats aren't good enough, is it? It's best to get rid of them. Yep. Level one pack your rhino. A level one. That's so weird, man. Yeah. That's three level ones now so far. So weird. Yeah, you don't fly past me. You get chumped. Hey, Mastercraft, uh. Air tank. You're oh, next. Nice. <laughs> All right. That yellow drop? Yeah, I did, yeah. Cool. Yeah, send it what? Send it what? Baryonyx saddle. Oh. Nice. Saddle or blue? Always uh, gotta, just a saddle. Always gotta ask. Is there a way to turn it into a blueprint? Um, uh, not really. Not. Anything down that way? I, I came from that way when we come up here. Did you? Yeah. I cleared off everything on the right, on this right side going down, or going west, I guess. He spawns pretty quick, so. Hopefully. I'm sure, we're hunting Dillos. <laughs> I just heard a methopithecus. I'm more for arms. <laughs> Mesopithecus. Sound like Mike Tyson for a minute there. What'd you say, gameplay? Metho. Me metho. Metho. Methopithecus. Wait, meth. Methopithecus. So, too bad we were hiding Dimetra dance. There's lots of them kicking around. Oh, I love those things. Tastes like chicken. <laughs> nope, it's a Rex. Oh, hold up, oh, sec. Yeah. Hold up, sec. Find a horse. Where'd you go? Nope. 135 wild female Rex. Eat it. We oh, you're still Rexes. 150. Come on, oh. man. Allosaurus up here, too. We're going to eat him first. Yeah. What's that horse up there? Let's try to get the fish. Come here, I killed you. Yeah. you gonna... Certain thing, hang a sec. I'm just checking it in to see if it's worth with keeping. <laughs> All right. All right. We're gonna go this way this time. Yeah, there's some. Uh... Hobbit's still trying to get beat. Beat my shots. Come on, man. It <laughs> <coughs> was a 150, oh, man. man. I don't care. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> we agreed. We have enough. Oh, we agreed. I'm, I'm, I'm claiming baby, see if I can get that, that actual level. Yeah, I done like, I don't know, five or six one day, and I never got none of them.
Yeah, it's so weird. They never really define hey, yeah. what does it or said that it's just random or not random or... We've tried waiting, we've tried moving the babies, all kinds of crap. And the results just aren't consistent. Mm. No. Wow, that, that sounds like it's random then, doesn't it? Yeah, that's the best we can figure, it's just random. country. <laughs> that, that one wasn't very tanky. He must have been hurt already. Watch out for that thing. It'll spin in the water and stun you. If it lives long enough? Yeah, if it lives long enough, yeah. Yeah, the Baryonyx can be a little scary in the water. Yep. Yeah. Are you 30? I got cornered by one of them a few days ago and then knock, it knocked me off my uh, mount. Yeah. I barely got out with my life. Nothing worse than getting deep. Dismounted in this game. Oh man. Yeah. Especially when there's a couple of raptors after you. Yeah. It's usually not a yeah, creature quite... that dismounts you that kills you. It's what it dismounts you in front of. Yep. Ah. Can't even time the uh. What is it? Microraptor. Microraptor. But dismount us in front of like alphas. Yeah. In front of fairies. Alpha kernels. Whatever, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Just off. It, it, the Microraptor did nothing but dismount you. It was everything else that so did all the damage and all the problems. Yeah. Oh. I'm pretty sure that's how I got one of the Microraptors was by he dismounted me and just stood in front of me. <laughs> until yeah. I not when I, on there. Saturday, when I was doing a doing a, a solo run, I got pretty startled when this this huge alligator just launched itself at me. Oh, that's oh, the yeah. camper. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it's like it's a flying alligator. What's going on? Yeah, it'll make you crap your pants the first time. Yeah, it took me clean off the mount as well. And it takes you quite a distance. Yeah. It did. And you, and you don't know what to do to get out of it either. Yeah. Run. <laughs> First time it I got hit like by four one or five of those, crimes. it was on the very west coast of the island, or the very east coast of the island there. I was walking kind of, I was heading north, and that part where the swamp goes out to the ocean, I was there. Oh, yeah. And a capro hit me, and I got leached at the same time. So I had no oh, idea well. what was going on. I, I had this creature in the middle of the screen, the leech. And I'm in some creature's yep. mouth, and I'm like, what the hell? <laughs> no idea. <laughs> that was a bad death. <coughs> Maybe it was partial to leeches. That was a bad day. Oh, yeah. It's never a good day to die, though, is it? Nope. It's always a good day to die. <laughs> <laughs> Hobby, you're not married Only anymore. the good die young. Yeah. I, had a, I had a weird glitch the other day. We had glitch climbing up a cliff <laughs> on the thyla and I got to the top of the cliff and just kept going and just kept going upwards. Yeah, you gotta be careful with that. The thyla has always done that. You'd end up at the top of the screen, then you fall and Lots something yep. happened. You die. You kill the yeah, kill the mount. <laughs> I yeah, I, I I stopped and jumped and he managed to survive. So, oop, out of stamina.
Yeah, last thing I wanted to do was die to a glitch, eh? Yeah, that's the frustrating part of this game, is dying to something stupid. It's one thing if you screw up and you get yourself killed. Eh, alright, fair enough. Any idea when they're going to fix the glitch where the dinos just collapse when, like, when they zero torpor? What do you mean? Well, you know, <clears throat> is it the torpor that's got to be up, up when they collapse, yeah? Yeah, you, you take the torpor all the way up and they, they collapse. Yeah. I've had I've had it where they, they just pass out, they collapse when there's like zero torpor. I had a look online and it is a known glitch, but they, whether they're going to have a favor fix it or not, I don't know. What, are, are your creature or a wild creature? I've had it happen. To, I've had it happen to mine. It also it also happened to your bird, the afterburner, the other uh, on Saturday. Oh, he didn't. Okay, so. With the with and the they end up like RG. It's not that he passed out. That's a visual glitch. That's all that is. It? Oh he right. Lays down with his wings spread out. Is that what you're talking about? Yep. Yep. That's yeah, it. Yeah. So if he's on top of a um like a boat or certain structures and stuff like that, it'll do that sometimes. And it looks like he uh, passed right. out, but he didn't pass out. It's just visual. Ah, I got you. That explains it. Yeah. Oh, he does the sprawl. Think... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. He looks like he's planking. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> pose. Yep. Yeah, it's pretty wild looking. Like, first time it happened, I was like, what the hell? Oh, okay. It's just. I know. Yeah, because it happened to one of mine. It's like. It looks so like he's I, dead. I mean, hey, I mean, hey, he you went online to check what was going on. My birds. And people were complaining about. You know, a lot of people complaining about them passing out when they're zero torpor. Um, but, yeah, it looks like... No, I didn't see any mention of it being a graphical glitch, but that does explain it. Yeah, yeah, that's been like that for years, so... Oh, right. I know exactly what you're talking about there. So they're not in any rush to fix it, I guess. Nah. It's one of those kind of funny glitches. Like when you're sliding around on the ground, but you're really walking, but it looks like you're sliding like what happened to Hobbit with us. With Hobbit, yeah. Right. Yeah, come on, guys. This didn't fall out 76. <laughs> oh, hell. Uh, stuck, hang about. Alright. You didn't get over, did you? I'm trying to get over this cliff. <laughs> uh, go to your left. There you go. There you go. Over here. Yep. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I think there's probably, between the, the Equus and the Sheep, uh, there's probably like the two worst spawning creatures in this game. Yeah, the Equus, yeah, this is a hard map for both of them. No other map is it this hard to find them. I think everyone wants them, that's what might be why they, they love spawning. Make you work for them. And they get killed by everything, so. Yeah. I mean, the Equus has a little yeah. bit of a fight in it, and, and it can run pretty quick. So it can't escape some stuff, but you know, the a lot, sheep, a lot though, of times it's, like... it's running out of the fire, and, you know, out of the frying pan into the fire. And the sheep, yeah, they're just screwed. Everybody likes mutton. Yeah, if you want to find sh sheep, you got to do like we're doing. Just patrol the area where they spawn and kill everything. Yeah. And eventually, one may spawn in. Yeah, right now spawning right next to a T Rex or something. Oh yeah. Oh, there's a. I just seen a. Uh, you have to work oh, for something. The giant jumping lizard. Yeah, I just saw the capper over there. You guys capper. be careful. Yeah. I'm gonna go. Oh, something eat it. Oh, Sarko eat it. <laughs> Good. Come on, man. Give us a horse. My kingdom for a horse. 
Yeah, definitely horses would not live over here. <laughs> not for very long, anyway. Yeah. <laughs> They can get away from dillos and stuff like that. Black holes and cap rolls are going to eat them. <laughs> yeah, they're not going to do so well against them. Diamond are going again. <laughs> yep. Titus, what level have you hit now? I haven't been on. I'm still at 85. Okay. Still respectable. Mm -hmm. I'm 79. All right. So, nice. I was mentioning it earlier. I'm going to build a, uh, a chat room in the, uh, ser in the uh, Discord for this server. Mm -hmm. So, if you guys want to, like, message in there, like, if somebody wants to get on and do something you guys can communicate in there and set up you know set up some times and cool you know, yep hook up uh, I got one of those blue suit things too on my fridge my base mm -hmm. I mean, really take that you can you hear that everybody beef wants you to set up play dates with each other okay play, play <laughs> yeah nice. no reach oh, around <laughs> don't kill my creatures yeah <laughs> Just kill right. But we're gonna try and get everybody their own stuff so that we're good. Keep him away from Hobbit then. <laughs> <laughs> he loves killing creatures. That's right. Everybody embrace the hate. <laughs> Hobbit killed more dinosaurs than the asteroid. <laughs> yeah. Nice <laughs> age. There's that 150 Rigonathra. Yeah, we're gonna get him. It's a female, too. Yep, we're gonna get her. Causing trouble, spitting at everybody over there. We gotta make uh, make some space and breed in, up uh, some uh, Brontos. It's close to your base now, Beef. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, there's crystals down in the water there. See, so I'm at... The square... Above your base and the square to the right. That's where he's at. Oh yeah, I know what you're saying. Yeah. them wandering out on this little hunk of land before I look I looked it up and uh, the Equus will spawn to the left of the volcano in that green area so I'm looking there now oh really okay do they share the uh, spawn with anything is that Chris a conscious conscious I you gotta be anything that's like in between a Moss shops to a parasaur to a guanodon to maybe a therizinosaur size. Yeah, I think I don't know how it works. I don't know if they it goes by carnivores or by small, or medium size. I think it's by. Isn't that right with the equus? You got to show a dapple of its ass or something like that to tame it. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Stick a carrot in its ass, but I got a secret weapon. You got a carrot gun, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> gonna stick some kibble in his ass. <laughs> yeah. And then ride him. So he wants me to stick more kibble in his ass. <laughs> I forgot to is that what word. you call it? A kibble, yeah. is it? <laughs> <laughs> and I just grab some ass. carrots. Same way. Yeah, if he needs any kibble, I got the, I got lots of kibble. Oh yeah. I am bringing any with me, but if I find one, I'm gonna just haul it to do space. There you go. I got like. 200 on me, or 100 and... Yes. Yeah, I had 118 on me. I brought some in case I find one that looks like it's going to be fairly easy to tame, and... But yeah, much safer to bring it to the base. Mm 
build a horse riding pen. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it'll work in that little tiny cave right outside, or that little tiny cage right outside my base. You don't need anything bigger than that. Will it work in there? I oh, thought yeah. it used to glitch out. Well, that was before. Remember, the, the horse was broken in the beginning when this came out. Yeah. But they fixed it. I tested it out and they fixed it. Because I tried it in the wild, too, and it wouldn't work. And it should only take a, three or four pieces of kibble, I would think. Yeah. Stamina again, guys. What's up? Get your there you stamina. go. Come on. You gotta fix, get your aerobic uh, exercises going. Get your stamina up, boy. He's been running for hours, no wonder he's knackered. Yeah. I don't know if I ever take some off of uh, running. I know, I don't. <laughs> he's just naturally <laughs> lying enough to, uh, I guess, fill back up. Yeah, they load up pretty quick, so that's good. <clears throat> Martin in the chat says, uh, No Man's Sky updated 10 o'clock last night. Hey, Martin. So we're uh, going to have to check that out. Really? What kind of update was it? It wasn't the big one that uh, Sean was advertising, was it? Because I haven't seen anything on that. He dropped a emoji yesterday, I think. I saw that, the one with like the star with the circle. Yeah. That's always a sign, like, it's usually pretty quick. Bug. Oh, bug clip. Bug, bug actually. Okay. Really? Well, that's good. But yeah, we'll probably see it within, uh, I would say maybe Thursday this week if he's already dropped the <coughs> emoji. Because he usually comes out the same week that he drops the emoji. Yeah. Be interesting to see how um, how much longer they keep updating that game with uh, Light and Fire coming out. Light and Fire looks really good. It does, yeah. I mean, it looks yeah, really it does. good. That's another reason I got the PS5. Light and Fire. The um, yeah, it's, I mean, it looks like you know when I first saw it, I was like, holy crap, they are totally revamping No Man's Sky. It looked like it was like the next big thing. In No Man's Sky, and I was like, oh, wait a minute, it's a whole new game. Yeah, absolutely badass. Look. Mm hmm. And with everything they learned for the, year, the years working on No Man's Sky, and I, I think they'll get it right this time, yeah. And I gotta hand it to Hello Games. After that whole launch and all the trouble with it and all that, <coughs> they totally changed how oh, they God, yeah. it, and it works. You know, yep. they never asked for a dime while they're fixing the game. Yeah, like how nope. many games I'm... do you know have been supported for? What are we looking at? Eight years now, without yep. a single yeah. microtransaction, a single paid DLC. Or anything. Even the upgrade was free. The upgrade for PlayStation was free. The upgrade for VR for PlayStation Five was free. You know, next gen. Uh, the one That's for amazing. VR was free. I gotta hand it to him. That goes to show that it can be done. It just makes all the other studios look worse. You know. Even the Switch version works very, very well. Yeah. Yeah, I know, I know it doesn't have all the uh, features, but that's, you know, it's a limitation of the Switch right there, but I heard it was great, you know, they really worked, they got it, they put it, but what they did do that was kind of smart is they released it for, it started, it was a uh, PlayStation and uh, PC, and then eventually it went to Xbox, and then it was Switch, and then it was uh, Mac. I mean, things been released for yeah. all over the place. Every time there's a new location for it, they make a little bit of money, you know, which is good. But that's straight up legit. That's new people buying. Yep.
I'll go walk the dog. I'll be back in a few minutes. All right, man. Switch amiibo. Uh, what is that? What's the switch amiibo? You ever see that Skylander toy? Uh, that that come out for system? No. It's a uh, plastic uh, figure with microchip inside that you can scan. You have a special portal. Nintendo has it um, scanned, built right into the controllers. Yeah, I've seen those. Okay. They had them like for popular IPs and stuff like that, right? Yep. Is that what an amiibo and, is? Yeah, um, for Legend of Zelda, you get all of those figures and you scan in, they give you um, food to eat, um, arrows, we um, a few weapons, specialty stuff that might come with that character. So it was a way to make more money off the game through DLC without, um, but it also gave you value in a, in a collectible for people who wanted a collectible. Yeah. I got you. That's pretty cool. Yeah, and yeah, that is cool. Thanks. And it's it always a, uh, always renewable. Every day you could scan it and get something. Oh, okay. So you didn't scan it once, and it's like, all right, well, here's you know twenty mutton. Thanks. Yeah. No, it's um, no, it's usable all the time, and it worked for different games too. You could use that Zelda figure in a Mario, and vice versa. Yeah, I can see the value in something like that, and that creates that alternative stream of income. Because I get it. Wolf Link is the best in Breath of the Wild. Ah. Okay, I'll be back. Wolf Link. All right, what? man. Wolf Link. I guess that's a version of Link, like a, as a wolf or a werewolf or something, maybe. I don't know. I never played Breath of the Wild. Neither have I. I left Nintendo. Oh, I don't... swear. I, I, I want to play it, though. Yeah, you don't know understand? Hmm? They fixed the doors. What do you mean, the, the the lag? When I'm at your base, when I pass through the doors now, it's not like it's uh, dropping my FPS to nothing. <laughs> oh, let me go check that out. I was just at my base earlier, and I didn't pay attention. I just got, you know, there's so much, I just ignore it, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I got some stuff to put away. I got some reasonable armor, then. And I never a couple got of crossbows. Sale. I never got their sail from that uh, spinal. Yeah, it feels better. Yeah. Yeah, I got a sail from the spinal. Yeah, I got one. Where'd you, where'd you put them? Right here in this Over box. in this box, yeah. In there, yeah. That's where all the animal parts go like that, yeah. Ah, uh, they're in my, uh, in my, in my cat. My silo. Let's go get him. Alright, I am flying all the way east again on Afterburner. Where did he go to? Who? Uh, who was here? Was it Neil or Neil was here. Trench? Yeah. No, Trench isn't on tonight. He uh, is having issues oh, okay. with, with um, internet. Xfinity. So hold I don't know. If, I don't know if any any of that stuff I just found randomly while I was out searching here. I didn't know if any of that stuff would be any good to him. Yeah, that's why I What's keep that? that box. It's kind of like a catch-all box for whatever. Um, uh, I got uh, like a 145 crossbow, uh, 126 pistol, uh, 169 X. I don't know if that's any good to you. Metal axe, yeah. Metal axe. Oh, take the take the axe, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Where are you two? I'm over by the the big forge, but I'm going into the the longhouse now. Okay, I'm I'm on, I'm over you. Come back here again. Oh. Come back towards the forge. On this bird. No, 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 no. Come back, come back, come back, come back. Turn around. Home on this bird. Home. I got you. Yeah. You look at this bird, and there's an axe on there. You can take it. One sixty-nine. Awesome. You can take the gun or the crossbow too if you want it, but it's up to you. Um, 
Awesome. That actually would be great. You can take two if you want to, and take the other one if you want for a backup. Pardon? You can take the other axe too if you want to just keep it for a, a backup. It's only a hundred, but it's something. I got, I've, got a, I've got a standard axe, actually. Oh, okay, best gun. Yeah, so you're right. Do you want me to put the crossbows and stuff away in the, in the box in the longhouse? If you want, you can throw them in there, yeah. That's yeah. kind of like a catch-all for if anybody loses their crap and they just need to gear up real quick, they can go get whatever they want out of there. It's not the best in the world, but... It's better than nothing, right? I used to yep. keep a suit of clothes in there for when I come from my base to here via the transport system. Yeah, that little... So I just have something yeah, to no. put on when I got here. Yeah, yeah, that little room I that's over there, you just put a box in there and store some crap in there if you want. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you keep all your armor, spare armor and weapons in here, isn't that? Not me, my Somebody... spare armor's upstairs. Up in my no, I'm ready. Put a bunch of stuff in your, uh, bunch of scuba stuff and a crossbow and spear. There's a baryonic, uh, ascendant baryonic saddle here as well. Oh yeah. Bunch of uh, scuba gear here. Scuba. We still haven't found a good ascendant scuba tank, have we? Not, uh, not, not, not a blueprint. Blueprint. Yeah. Those are probably in the caves of all of that places. Yeah, probably, yeah, go back probably in the back. easy water cave, right? <laughs> yeah. I might go uh, in that cave again, the swamp cave, and hmm. raid it a few more times. Yeah, that was Maybe get some more good one. blueprints. It's always a useful cave. Apprentice crossbow, yep. Yeah. Yeah, we have a blueprint for an ascendant crossbow, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I think all the major stuff that you would need, it like, uh. Pretty sure we got an axe, uh, yeah, pickaxe. Yeah, axe, axe, we got pick a pickaxe, pick we got a spear. Yeah. Yeah. Sword, Rifle. too. Yeah. Yeah, I got like a spinal cell here as well. And the Therizino claws. Sauropod vertebra. Yeah, you can throw all that in there. Mm hmm. Most of the other stuff we have a decent amount of. Megalania toxin we could always use. The spino sales seem to be a little on the short end. I think everything else is in pretty good shape. Maybe Megalodon. I've, I've, got, <laughs> I've got some the toxin in, in my base, so I'll bring it over when I get a chance. Megalania toxin? Oh, yeah, that'd be great, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we mm -hmm. use that for boss fights. Cool. Well, did you say some of your summon bosses with it yet? Uh, yeah. Come on, give me a horse. I think I'm actually going to pop off a bit early. Nice. Alright. How's the family doing? Everything's good? Yeah, pretty good, yeah. Good. Little girl's got a touch of the flu again. Um, they're good at that, aren't they? <laughs> oh, man. Magnets. Yeah. <laughs> like somebody well, I swear she was sweet for at least four months straight. <laughs> Whenever my sister had three daughters in the house at any given time, right? And uh, I'd go over there. <laughs> there were always, like, various stages of being sick. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Yeah. It's like, Ocean, yeah. she's just recovering, but Kira just got it, and I think just long uh, enough for him Shay's to... just starting to cough a little bit. Yeah, just <laughs> enough to pass. It's really long enough just to catch it again, right? To yeah. restart the cycle. <laughs> it's like, your house is like a Petri dish. <laughs> yeah, very much. And then there'd be their father, Mark. He'd always, he was always part of the thing, too. <laughs> what about Mark? Oh, he dead. <laughs> now, you're playing on PC as well, aren't you? I am, yeah. What do you run for a graphics card? Pardon? What's your graphics card? A 3060. Nice. Yeah, I no longer got it. 
I was had a 1070 before, but that's it. Def it was showing a sage. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. I had a 1080. <coughs> mhm. Mm <clears throat> and I went to a 2070. Yep. A liquid gold. Nice. And uh, now I'm on the 3080. I'm currently saving up to build a new PC, but it's taking me about 12 months to get the money together. Mm. I just put a 14600K into it. Redone to put a new board in RAM. Nice. But uh, that's my next one now. Wait for the uh, 5000 series to come out when it comes out. That's why I'll probably change it to the mm -hmm. end. Yeah, we'll be seeing that soon, won't so we? Expensive. That's so expensive. <laughs> what do you reckon? Will yeah. This will go brand new. Two, three grand. Uh, well, it depends on the, so which one, right? Like, yeah. You're, you're not, yeah, if you go with a, uh, like a thirty, or like a fifty, eighty, which would probably be around twelve hundred bucks, thirteen hundred bucks. Yeah. And the low end, I'm thinking. Yeah. Mhm. Mm Man, I used to build whole PCs for that one time. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. My current PC cost me about eighteen hundred, something like that. And that was a that was a nice one at the time. Yeah. Eight years old now, showing its age. Well, this I had a, a before I put the the board and CPU on this, I was running a ninety seven hundred K, and playing this game, I was at a hundred almost a hundred percent max all the time. Wow. That's I good. play a fourteen forty P, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, Trench is back. Hey. We up. We're back in Discord, at least. Yeah. Well, he's on the game. Play the show and playing Eric. Oh, good. Okay. Guess he got the internet squared away. Yeah, can you, can you guys hear me? I can hear you now. Oh, we can. So, I think the problem is my modem, my internet router, so tomorrow I'll be replacing that. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, sorry about that. That's crazy. No, nah, no worries, man. No worries. Just glad you got it no. figured. Is it your like, own? I was, I was downloading one of the mods. It was six, 700 and something megabytes, and it that whole time you guys been playing, I only got to like 500. <laughs> so, oh, wow. And then... And then I uh, restarted my home router, and then all of a sudden, boom, done. So, oh well. I'll at least see if I can get in, so. Yeah, yeah let's get in, and we'll get you somewhere safe. We'll still be on for about another hour here. We're horse hunting, and we're not having much luck. The Hobbit's been doing some breeding and stuff, so we'll have you some of the basics to start building with. Maybe a pair of thylas. All that fun stuff. And I got a armoire you can read for weapons and armor. But if you want a horse, you're SOL. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, eager raptor, whoever it is. Oh, the over raptor? Spawned inside, it spawned inside my base. Ha. Got murdered, huh? Not a rap raptors are killing them. Yeah. <laughs> or the uh, Rexus. So I say, I wouldn't expect them to live long in there. No, no. Yeah, stamina. Which obelisk? Red obelisk? That area? Uh, yeah, that's a good spot to spawn in. Come yeah, on. if any of you guys are looking to uh, harvest some metal, uh, it's probably better to go over to like, the Hobbit's base or my base and use to go up on Metal Mountain. Oh, yeah. 
usually get like 10k, 10, 11 k at a time for a trip. <clears throat> yep, especially with a good Anki. If he needs like stone or wood, I got him boxes. <laughs> if you guys need fiber, <laughs> you talk to me. Yeah. You got like mm -hmm. five million fiber. Fiber. Yeah. Or, uh, less, uh, how did you get that much? Polymer. <laughs> Most of it was hand picked by Bigfoot in my yard. He is just a hard working SOB. Yeah. We just set him off to. Got to gather, yeah? Yeah, put him on wander and he just wanders around picking it. He's great. Do they do they put it in any in storage or just keep it on him since till they're full? He keeps it on himself, so the higher you raise his weight, the more he'll carry. Mm-hmm. And fiber's pretty light as well. Yeah, yeah, so when I get to him he usually has like forty K on him. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know if any fellas been over to my base yet, but I got like the Great Wall built around acreage. Oh, his base <laughs> is like Jurassic Park. It's pretty wild, man. You can almost hear the music when you come over the map, over the hill, and you see the great big walls. Which base is that? Game place. Yeah, I, I I come across these walls, and they're they're like hundred feet high. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. <laughs> and the, it uh, is kind of crazy. One of I was like. Is I, around inside. Yeah. What the hell's that? I, it's like, ah, it's gameplay space. Yep. <laughs> Hobbit's right. got like a Site B kind of feel to it. Yeah. He's got that. They just hire him at the border with that wall. <laughs> you know, he still has the wall and all that, but he's got a, a larger base base, so to speak. And if you want fun in the sun, you come to my base. Are you spawned in yet, Trench? Yep, I'm in. All right. Where you at, Trench? Uh, I'm working my way towards Red Ob. Okay. I'm flying. I'm at 85.15 right now, running along a beach. I was off toward the east, so I'm heading your way. Getting foggy. There you go, like 10k for a uh, hide on that room. <coughs> oh, nice. Yeah, Thylos are real good for hide. I need to build that the uh, dehydronator over this. Oh, to make uh, jerky? Yeah, well, I've just been doing it in the regular yeah. jerky maker. But... Oh, it's great in that, de that dehydrator or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, take a look through the different um, mods on there, guys, because there's some really good ones that'll help you out. Like the QOL Plus stuff is amazing. If you need explanation <laughs> on some of it, if you're not familiar with it, just ask. We, we're pretty good with them now. Storage mod is great because it's got storage, refrigerators, all kinds of crap. Yeah, some good mods in that. Yeah, but nothing beats the one for um, the cryopods. Oh, I crystal left. There you go, crystal. Uh... Crystal shopping. It's <laughs> <laughs> the one thing your uh, guys don't get, huh? No. All right. So who else was it that made their dude really small? Was that you, Titus? Oh, he's out. He's out uh, having a smoke. I forgot. So Titus, he's walking, he's dying, isn't he? <clears throat> didn't he make his guy really small? Like hobbits? Yeah. Yeah, he, yeah he's really short, yeah. Broth of Enlightenment. Yeah, I get one of those kicking around here. If anybody, everyone of the boys wants to take it. So delicious. 
All right. Now I'm so on the beach on my way to the Red Obelisk Trench. Well, he's new, isn't he? He's fresh. He's fresh. Yep, and I'm getting murdered by compies. <laughs> three, three of them that chased me and I'm like oh, I'm bleeding out <laughs> uh, this will be the last day that happens <laughs> you know what though as much as I play this game it's always fun to start over I love the beginning of this game yeah like on my other map that I'm playing on that other server I think I need six more mutations to max out the rexes to be fully like you know maxed out their stats so I'm just kind of doing that over there because I'm kind of bored with everything else on the uh, community server uh, on the one I play with my other buddy oh, okay. before I started okay. playing with you guys <clears throat> alright so when you say yeah, fully maxed pulled. out what are you looking at 255 for the base yep oh, okay. oh wow yep. yeah you're really serious about I it then yeah, I'm. Uh, I think I need six more mutations, and then that's done. Nice. Two fifty-five. What? Base stat. That's the highest base stat you can have on a creature, and it will still level up, right? Level up the stat or something. Yeah, they're pretty. Uh, it's like having a baby Giga when you have a Rex at that stat. Yeah. yeah. You just go to boss fights and murder everything. Yeah, if you can get like your. Uh melee and your health on 255 each then you just level them up from there you're, you're pretty sick <laughs> right time for another coffee I think always oh, time it's always time for coffee I like my coffee like how yeah, sure. strong black and bitter. <laughs> yeah. All right. Let's see, are you south of the obelisk or uh I'm right at the obelisk. I'm running around it just keeping the uh copies from getting me oh, okay. actually That's i think right i see you flying up there i'm coming right up the ramp behind you you want to kill those copies that are chasing me sure <laughs> Little bastards how many were there there's a funny thing there's a funny thing about that word I think there was three but i don't see the others does he want to not really will he maybe <laughs> oh, there you go i found a uti there oops i gotta catch another uti uh -oh. come on man Crap. Oh, more UDs. Right. There we go. Missed the rocks this time. <laughs> we'll bring you to a copy-free area. start rendering in any minute now. Yep, I see it. <clears throat> well, ladies and gentlemen, it's been fantastic. Out, my friend, and I am most. Well, I guess I'll see you on Thursday. All right, man. You leaving half bud. an hour early before the stream ends? How before dare the you. stream ends. Wow. Yeah. Well, it's not like I'm going to dock his pay. Out of the tribe. <laughs> out of the tribe. <laughs> I'll dock his pay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll see you gameplay.
Get around, fellas. You have a narco in while he's sleeping. <laughs> you go. stay in my base. Hop Alright, trenches in. Alright. Jeez, you guys got a zoo over here. Yeah, it's been a... It's been a bit <laughs> of a mess. Hobbit's been helping out with the breeding and... Things have gotten out of hand. <laughs> but it's all good. It's working out good. Yeah, he regrets it already. So if you want some... Uh... Alright. Oh, you're here too? Yeah, I'm here. Alright. So if you want some gear, right, I'll trench. show you where the gear is right now. Yep. And that storage locker right there, feel free to take whatever you need out of it. Alright. It's just some shit to get you by until we get the uh, better stuff built. Should we start in gear? Oh, that's a pretty green owl. Yeah, I like I like that guy. Alright, so what have we been breeding up, Hobbit? I've got Anks, I've got Theries, I've got Dodicorous. And I got where, where's the Dodickers at? What the hell? I have them out. They should have been breeding. No, they haven't been breeding. No, 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 not that. Alright. I don't have enough crystal. What? What happened to all my crystal? Holy crap. Alright. Well, it wasn't me. I didn't take it. No, I know you just got here. <laughs> Holy crap. I was going to make another cryo fridge real quick. Here, buddy. Alright, well, we'll have beavers at least. Oh, that might have been me with a crystal. Oh, you grabbed a bunch of crystal? Alright. No, I um, I made some windows, so. Oh crap! Yeah, yeah I, I did it. <laughs> I, I was gonna I was gonna take a trip up the mountain and get some more for you, but I yeah uh, I forgot. That's all right. I'm Thanks gonna, for reminding me. I'm gonna grab some real quick right now so I can make that fridge. So. I've got some castroids here. Do you want male or female? French. Oh, I didn't know you were talking to me. Doesn't matter. Yeah. I'll take whatever. Alright. Yes, we've been breeding up like That's perfect you? stats out of all the guys and then just, you know, for like those kind of working dinos. I mean, they don't need 40 mutations on them. But <laughs> and then some idiot goes and gets them all killed, yeah? That's alright. See, with this tribe, we can replace animals very quickly. Yeah, that's cool. But what you don't want to do I is tell you, lose, what I, you don't want to lose good stats. I did a Baryonyx. I did a Baryonyx with uh, 30 mutations, and that thing's pretty OP. Yeah, we've got them yep. with 20, I think, right? Yeah, 20 mutations. 10 and 10 on health and, uh, and um, melee. And they're pretty solid, man. Why that? Things awful close. <coughs> yeah, either later tonight or tomorrow, I'm gonna go get a load of crystal and obsidian up the mountain. Right on. Yeah. The yeah, I'll bring it. Well, no, take it for yourself. If you need it, start stocking up your base. I'm going to get some crystal right now. That's all I need right now is a little crystal. So all right. I'll be fine with that. I've been, I've, I've spent, I spent a lot of, lot of today and some of yesterday sort of building up my stone 
wood and, and iron supplies. I got about three grand of iron going, um, ten grand of wood, and about eight of stone. Good deal. And Hobbit's breeding up some replacement creatures for you. Uh, new awesome. Ones for trench and new and uh, replacements for. Uh, I guess you borrowed yep. the ones from Titus, so he's replacing those as well. Hmm. Yeah, sorry, Titus. I managed to get him killed. But those are easily replaced. You know, just a matter of leveling them up real quick, and it won't take long to level them. Just don't pick yeah. a fight with a Bronto. No. The worst thing is, I knew he was there, but I accidentally hit his leg while I was mining iron. Yeah, that happens And that, a lot. Imme yeah. that, that immediately aggroed the pair of them. That a couple a of bits from the... And I got hit by the one, one's tail, flew sideways right into the other. <laughs> <laughs> and he, he knocked me off the he knocked me off the mountain, and uh, that was it. That was me done. Like I say, I run back up, flapping about all my stuff, and I I run right into the middle of them, got killed again. They were still. Well, I was naked as well, so no protection. They were still aggro, yeah. They were still aggro, yeah. My bird was still fighting them. See. Oh, that's what happened. Yeah, yeah. Next time, you got a whistle. That bird passive and follow or whatever, get him out of there, let him de-aggro. I will, yeah, I'll, I'll remember that for next time. Yeah. Yeah, a bit of a learning It's, it's all right, it happens to all of us. Pardon? It happens to all of us. Yeah. It's just a learning curve, isn't it? Yep. Yep. Nothing like dying to, to teach you a lesson, eh? Hey, at least you get yeah. a second chance. Yeah, I think if I was solo, I might have quit losing everything like that. <laughs> <laughs> be a little frustrating. Yeah, like, I was mighty pissed off, I gotta admit. For, for about half an hour. as long as you learn something from each death yeah yeah don't take all your dinos out in one go yeah. especially in cryo storage oh yeah yeah if you don't need them don't take them nope I won't be doing that again leave, leave them on your bird if you want or something like that if you gotta take multiples out for whatever reason <laughs> you got a better shot of living on the bird yeah, they're a lot less vulnerable. It can fly as well, so we can get out of the way. Yeah, you can always whistle that bird passive and then follow and it'll fly away from whatever it's fighting. Passive and follow, yep. Yeah, for which I'd remember that, the, knew that the first by my um, my Thylo got attacked by that. That Gigantosaur or whatever it's called. Yeah. And like I said, yep. if you fight him right, the, that uh, Titanosaur can be killed by a Thylo pretty fairly easy. Just how would you, how do you do it? You just got to keep, well, so the Thyla does bleed damage, and it's like 5% right. of the total health of the creature. So when a creature has a health pool that big, that bleed damage is just enormous. Mounts up. Mm -hmm. So you just got to keep biting and, and, you know, clawing at him and getting him to bleed, and then move away occasionally and eat a little bit to replenish his health if you it, get a little low on it wasn't. It wasn't me that was in, in that much trouble. It was a bit, but... It was my other cat, my other Thyla, because there's no rider on it, so it was just yeah. going in and getting clobbered. Oh, see, so if you had two of them on there with the mate boost, you could have probably tore them up pretty quick. But yeah, the one with yeah. that rider, it's hard to say, and I don't know what kind, I don't remember what kind of... Oh, you got pretty good saddles on them, or you had pretty good saddles. Yeah, I did, yep. I think they were both Ascendant, weren't they? Yeah, I think so. I think I took the thing from Hobbits and made you a couple saddles. Alright. So, Trench, you said you want to live up north. Is that what you said? Well, I could build the snow if you guys want to see. It doesn't matter. No, I don't care. I, mean, I, always, pick, I always like to pick the rough places just because it makes it more challenging. Yeah, yeah. It's always like fun like do stuff like that. The only problem I, I they need to fix is on PC... When you build the snow, I still see snow in my base. When I go into my Xbox and get on, there's no snow in it. So it's like inside your house, it looks like there's, it's just snowing inside. Really? The floors are all white and everything. Yeah, it's really weird. That is kind of weird. Uh, 
like usually I build like right at the spot where all the uh, all the dangerous dinos are, so you can yeah. level up real quick and you're fighting alphas all day long. But oh yeah, the storage crate by the um, by the greenhouse there. There's about there's five thousand stone in there if anyone wants to use it. Okay. I can't be bothered uh, transporting it back, so. No sight of an Equus then? No, haven't found a decent Equus tonight. Look again next time. We'll find one. <laughs> They're out there. Yep. Uh, what does this thing want have? Oh, nice. All right. All right, we got Anki, Dodicris, Fever, Therizino, and two Thylas. All right. That's like you, Trench? The starter cat care package there. Who's this? Neil. All right. Neil. Oh, Trench. You need you need a start you need a starter care package, right? Sure. <laughs> Adolescent thirteen H right here inside of him. Open him up. Take all those animals and throw them out. Raise all them right. up. Yeah. Make sure you get an imprint on them. Yeah, it should only be one imprint on this uh on this server. Um might want to let's move over here, Neil. Or yeah, I mean, um, Trench over here. <coughs> all right, coming home with some crystal. Go ahead and throw them out over here. All right, they should be able to reach the uh, the lady. Yeah, so I've got a nanny who will feed your babies up to fifteen percent. Um, yep. I like her. She's cool. I don't have her set to imprint, though, because we do a lot of breeding or breeder creatures and, and all that. I don't like them to be imprinted, you know? Only my final creatures I like imprinted, so. <coughs> What's this blue barrier here? Well, it's not a barrier. I can walk through it, but it's like a... Yep. Yeah. So That's she probably reach, the water. She'll reach everybody here. Yep. Oh, is that for the, um, the nanny, yeah? Yeah, the big blue bubble that was me i i put it up a second okay. yeah that's 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 the limit of the influence yeah yeah same with the generator in there shows you yeah, yeah the feeding I mean, trials I will show see you how far, how I want, they cover yeah i want to see how far she'd go now you what do you need neil um two thylers and some birds and um gatherers as well yeah he needs all the gatherers he lost all his like a beaver for wood and stone. What's the best one for gathering berries? You can use a beaver. Yeah. A beaver's pretty solid, yeah. Uh, awesome. you'd also be able or a thyla. The... No, not the thyla. The headbutt. Oh, the theory. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, sorry. I'm just waiting now till I can level up enough to craft a chemistry station. I think it's level 82, something like that. Yeah, that was pretty Not high far. Yeah, you'll be you'll be ready to craft everything soon. And trench, yeah. if, you want, if you want trench, you can go to my chemistry t station and make a crap load of narcotics. Just pull the stuff yep. in there because I've got more spoiled meat than a Taco Bell and nar more narcotics than LA. You know. Got a 150. There's five and a half thousand um, narcotics in the in the chem station there. Yeah. Already. Um, I heard a tip, by the way. Good way to spoil a load of meat is if you if you get a toilet, you put it in a the toilet, then use the toilet. Oh, it'll yeah. apparently it'll spoil a whole stack yep. at once. Have you got a toilet on base here anywhere? Oh yeah, right next to my little thatch house with the uh, sheep <laughs> in it and all that. Is that the one that keeps keeps catching on fire? It looks like it's on fire right next door to it, but it's not on fire. Yeah. 
Yeah, I, I, I was like freaked out the other day. It comes to your face <laughs> and it was burning. It's like, oh, shit, what's happening? I'm, I'm going to put this out. And it's like, Hobbit told me it's just something you did for the, to yeah. wind people up. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of neat looking. Uh, yeah, it's like, the, <laughs> what's where's the wisdom in putting a bunch of torches in a thatch home, you know? <laughs> Yeah, it's not the smartest move, is it? No, but it looks cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, at least you be warm, yeah. <laughs> it's like the saying goes, it's like So keep a man warm keep a man warm for the day, build him a fire. To make a man warm for the rest of his life, set him on fire. Yeah. <laughs> keep him warm for the rest of his life. Yikes. What was it? If you build a man on fire, he'd be warm for the day. If you set a man on fire, he'd be warm for the rest of his life. That's a Terry Pratchett oh, quote, that is. Yeah, that's funny. <laughs> Cash boys, empty. Yeah, treasure. Now you anything holler. else you need, feel free to breed it up or, you know, holler at us, we'll throw one down for you. Yeah, yeah I appreciate I'm, it. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, I'm gonna, I want to learn about a breed, so. Well, you got a professional breeder with us now, too, with Trench. Oh, look, okay, awesome. Thanks, Trent. Oh, I, I, I keep a spreadsheet and everything to make sure I know what my stats are. <laughs> so, I go crazy with that stuff. You're a breathing nerd, right? He, uh... Oh, yeah. You know what? I, I never understood it. And I watched a video like a year ago that I started. Oh. It, it's Trent. it's fun once you make super dinos. Oh, yeah. yeah I like Trent, that. You want... Trent, you want some RGs? Yeah, I could take one. Yeah, I've been kind of wanting to do the spreadsheet thing myself. <laughs> I'm like, oh, that's so tempting. I'd bring it up on my iPad right here in front of me so I could see my stats and then, you know, just kill off whatever I don't need, especially when you have that new cryo terminal. That thing's so easy. For the babies. Yeah. Like, all you need to do now is once French. you get, like, the perfect uh, stats on, on a male and a female, that's just looking for the number. It's like, oh, I need 248s. You know, you just wait till you get a 248, kill everything else. Yep. Those, are, those are weight RGs. Um... You can breed them up to do whatever. We're, we're going to get some super arches real soon. Awesome. All right. Nice one, Hobbit. And then uh, you, Neil, look inside mm -hmm. 13H over there. 13H. The, the, the baby, yeah? This guy right here. Oh, this. That's your care package. Oh, man. You're the star. Just waiting on a dodicris for you. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, I'll take them back to my base and uh No, who else who else needs a care package, Beef? Uh Titus. Got trench Titus. Okay, so he needs an Anki. Yeah, he's going to need all the basics. And then we're going to have to get new stuff for um, for gameplay, but not yet. When he's on, we'll do it with him, figure out what he needs. I'm going to practice some taming tomorrow as well. There you go. That's a good location on that island uh, because you can like start with small stuff like Ankies. You can tame them on foot, just running around in circles mm -hmm. backwards from them. Trikes are a little more tricky. Stegos are a little trickier. And Brano's will give you a real run. Just don't Anky. try to tame near your near your creatures or your house. <laughs> All right, because uh, yeah, they'll start aggroing, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and I, I learned that mistake. Don't aggro the Brontosaurus, especially when there's a couple of them. Yeah, don't piss either. those guys off. And try, and try not to fight them naked either. We have another baby um, fairy here. We mean. Oh, 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 oh this guy. Yeah, a little baby fairy. Look yeah, at him. Yeah. I didn't think the other one's twelve inch over there. Oh, is he an accident while you're breeding those guys up for the guys? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. What do these eat, by the way? So I'll, br I'll breed them up and we'll replace them. Nice. Either, um, those, I think everything you're getting right now is going to eat veggies and berries and stuff like that. 
Except for the thyla. Oh, yeah, the thyla's gonna eat meat. Yeah. Lots of meat. But he'll get you a mm -hmm. ton of meat, too. Run around on him for a few minutes and you're golden. Yeah. So I got Thylas, I got Theory, I got Beaver, and I got Enki. I don't know what else I'm missing here. I've got two RGs. Um, oh, you need two RGs there, um, Neil? I've got two. I've got a male and a female. Yeah, let us stick with the two for now. Um, I've got um, a male... Archaeosaurus. All right, so long haul is yours, right? What's a Castor Castorides? That's a beaver. Ah. Uh, oh, wait, 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 you don't need. I've got a male and female side thylos, and I've got um. What's a therm therizinosaur? Therizino. This is uh, yeah. Ark Survival of yeah. Martin. Or Survival Ascended, I'm sorry. Survival Ascended. So got, yeah, what's a Therizinosaur? I got two Thylas. I got a Ooh. Beaver, got a Theri, and an Anki for the next care package. Right on. The Theri is good at gathering fiber, and it's also good at gathering wood and thatch. It's good at gathering. It's good at killing. Something disappeared out of my inventory while I... All kinds of sorry. stuff. Sorry. Something just disappeared out of my inventory while I was... Uh... Did it go into your hot bar, maybe? Let me check. Oh. i got to remember to drink. Yep. I keep running out of water. No, it's not. Oh, yeah. This one in the hot bar. Yeah, it's usually what happens when something disappears from the inventory just inadvertently went to the hot bar. If you double click something, it goes into your hot bar. Mm hmm. On PC, you've got like an extended hotbar, and it's hard to get things out of it. Then, whenever you replace them and put it in your inventory, it pops straight back into the hotbar. It's a pain in the ass. Huh. Go fill my canteen up again. Yep, you can always drink out of the. Uh, I have a little spigot on the side of my fridge, or you can drink out of the ocean too if you don't want to empty your canteen. Yeah, because um, because I yeah I got a couple of canteens on me because I always manage to forget about my water and I end up flipping flashing red. Something I'm going to have to remember to keep an eye on. Yeah, that's something you'll definitely learn to keep an eye on. Yeah. Alright. So what else can we get you started with, Trench? I think I'm good with this. This is plenty. You got a nice little family here. Look at this. Yep. Yeah, these stylists are Unless you guys rough. want some Rexes. <laughs> oh, God. 
leave the damn Rexes alone for now. <laughs> Yeah, how much longer are those berry or those um, not berries? The uh, yeah, I'll go look at them. Basils, <laughs> the basils. Oh, nine health. What's that little thing chasing after you, Beefy? Oh, that's my little. That's a chibi. This little thyla chibi. Yep, it's a decorative thing. Yeah, it's that a thing that sits on your shoulder. Yeah. That's a shoulder pet. Mm-hmm. This is my micro raptor. I call him Chick fil A. <laughs> it's pretty cool looking, actually. I like this one. But he keeps the uh, micro raptors off me when I'm in the uh, running around the map and all that. They're flying around. Although that seems to be broken right now because I've been knocked off with them on my shoulder and I'm not happy about that. But it is what it is. All right. Shoulder pets, isn't it? Cute little uh, addition, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Yep. <laughs> here, I'll show you my other ones. Come here. Follow me. Got a few I'm following Bart. Got a few of them in here. Yeah? They all stay upstairs. Oh, what? Poopy pants. It's my little monkey. He throws poop. This is my... Uh, Hammering away. <laughs> yeah, he's like my pelican type guy. Here's my little otter. And then there's this disgusting thing. A, uh, a Pegomastix. He was my first one, actually. Found him on the beach. Tamed him halfway by yeah. accident. Yeah. I love those type of tames. Yeah, right? Yeah, I was just like, yeah, whatever, I'll tame him. I mean, even <laughs> now, he's only level 160. He's got 20 levels on him, but still. He was my first. My first one. Fallon. <laughs> yeah, because he steals shit from me. But yeah, this, yeah, is my, the... yeah, this is my little upstairs area. So all my personal crap I leave up here and everything else that... I just throw downstairs like take what you want. He's pretty cool his artifacts, isn't he? Yeah, they're nice. Yeah, we got a couple more runs to do. Is that by beating bosses you get them, yeah? The artifacts know by beating caves, actually. Right. Yeah, there's uh, ten caves. Each one has an artifact in it. What happens when you get all of them? We have all of them now. So, like, you use three. You, oh. you use them to summon bosses. Uh, three to mm -hmm. summon one boss, and then another three to summon the next one, and then four to summon the last one. Trench, if you need food or anything, I got a fridge full of food. If you need a canteen, I got a uh, little spigot of water sticking off of the fridge. It's got a couple of canteens in it. I'll take one of them. All right. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Lots of food. Oh, there's a spigot, yeah. If you want a beer, my gardener has all the beer. I saw the beer crate, yep. yep. She's got like 174 beers on her. <coughs> she's a she's a thirsty girl. She's Irish. <laughs> yep. She's a good Irish lass. 
<laughs> when you feed them berries, I'm assuming you'll feed them narco berries. No. So, like, creatures <laughs> will eat out of troughs, right? Right. And they will eat out of troughs before they eat out of their own um, inventory, so... I managed to pick up a feeding trough from a from a drop. So all right, so I got this one here, and I'll show you the distance that it um, covers. You can see the, the blue, right? You see where I am? Yep, I can see the uh, yeah, I can see the uh, the barrier. Yeah. Yeah. So as long as you keep food in your feeding trough, your guys are okay. And God, there's a huge radius in there. Well, this is a QOL feeding trough. This is better than the normal one. So I recommend building ah, this. Okay. Yeah. Otherwise, yeah, it's I will. Much. If you got the QOL mod, you get the blueprints for that automatically, do you? They're in your, yeah. If you look, look at your uh, engrams, engrams you yeah. get, just type in QOL and it'll show you all the different QOL things that you can get. Awesome. That'll make it easy for you. Most of them are either free or cheap but I think you have to have yeah. a prerequisite of the equivalent vanilla item like the storage container you have to have the vanilla one I believe I'm not 100% but I'm pretty sure what's the converter converts vanilla structures and, bl and blueprints into that QR component yeah I got you yeah that's this thing right yeah, here yeah so, so, so you put you put something in there and it'll it'll be a Q, change to QEL correct It only works on something that is available in both vanilla and QOL. What's a blueprint maker? Just Does... a blueprint maker? What? Oh, that turns. I think it turns building parts into blueprints. Isn't that what it does? Yeah. That one dinosaur mod, the, uh, what is it called? The Helicopron? I, they, they, we call it the Heli. Oh, that thing's cool. That's a cool... <laughs> yeah, it, I don't know if you guys seen, like, how it works. Like, you can make blueprints with it. I saw that. I, I Syntec did a video on that a while back when... I think it gives you, like, a percentage chance of either destroying the, the item or making it into a blueprint, right? It does, and you, but you can also mutate the stats so you can get 100% item. But you can only make it from items that were not crafted. So Some found items. Okay. Yep. It's pretty cool. That's still not bad. Yeah. Hey, um, Neil, you need yep. any dodicarus, right? I th yeah, I think so. Yep. Right in front of you. Thank you, dude. You're done. And then, I am uh, dynamite. What? I'm dynamite. Yep, you're done. Thank you so much, Hobbit. You're a star. <laughs> Thank you. And then uh, I got another set of uh, people for the next person. Who's who's the other one that needed it? We got Trench and we got uh, Titus as well. You raised Titus. my mood. No, no yeah, end there, Trench Hobbit. Trench has everything, right? Yeah, Trench is good. Yeah, yeah Trench has yeah, good. Titus. All right, so we got Titus. Titus I got right inside up. that. I got I got Titus's stuff right here. Inside the new so, bridge. Um, yeah. So with the feeding trough, yeah, you you create one like the the nanny, yeah, and he and she'll make sure they're fed when when they're when they're babies, yeah. Yeah, but you won't be able to make a nanny right away because you're going to need all that blood for it. So, um, but just in the beginning, you could put a little bit of food inside your uh, creature, like if it, mm. you know, like for the uh, thylos, put some meat in them. For the other ones, just put some regular berries in there. But they grow okay, up pretty cool. quick. They'll probably grow up before they starve anyway. They'll start mm -hmm. eating out of the trough at 10% maturity. All right. So what I'll do, I'll, I'll, as soon as I get back, I'll build the trough. and. That's a funky-looking cape. What are you wearing? Whatever the generic cape was, I didn't pick anything. That is weird. <laughs> I know. I was like, why is mine got to be? Mine's the, uh, the Walmart brand, I guess. Yeah, you got like... <laughs> It's weird because, like, from the front, it disappears. 
I like the yeah, I can, of invisibility. We got some Harry Potter shit going on here. <laughs> I can make the nanny already. It's level 40 engrams for that. Right, but you need 50 uh, blood, don't you? Oh, yeah, yeah. Where'd you get that from? <laughs> you got to drain your own blood or drain the blood of uh, other tribe members. Uh, yeah, so it'll take a lot of time for that. I mean, you can start working on it, like, okay. drain yourself some blood, put it in the fridge. How did you, you do that? You make a uh, syringe. I might have some blood to start you off. Let me see. Uh, no. Blood extraction syringe, okay. Yeah, That's I don't cool. have any in there, so. No, you're right. I'll, I'll, I'll come vampire on myself. There you go. Oh, man. What's going on? What? Oh, that? I got ichthyosaurs out here, and my uh, plants are just murdering the poor things. They don't usually do that. <laughs> Who's kiting them over? I don't know, man. They usually don't come up here. That's kind of funny. Plants are just shredding them. <laughs> well, the um, oh, these things, yep. Yeah. The defensive plants. Yep. Yeah, Trench, that looks really cool at night. It looks like it's on fire. <laughs> <laughs> All we need is some people yelling uh, about George Floyd running around it. You'll think it's like 2020 all over again. <laughs> <laughs> too soon? All right, too soon. <laughs> <laughs> Remember we used to get George Floyd in the comments? George Floyd used to watch the uh, stream, so we used to have somebody named George Floyd. <laughs> <laughs> I heard he's been clean for a couple of years now. <laughs> 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 <But I'm tss. laughs> Ooh. Oh man. That guy did not sound happy. Those are some good looking archies with the blue on them. I like them. Is there any berries that work? I can feed them? Apart, obviously, I don't want narco berries, but. Yeah, no narcos and no um, stim berries. All the others are okay. Yep. Or if you cool. want to grab, and uh, if you want to grab a stack of uh, berries from here, feel free. Or however many you can carry. I won't be able to carry a full stack, but no, I won't. <laughs> I mean, you could also grab some carrots or some potatoes or any of those vegetables those will work the same as the berries you know they just feed they provide more food per bite that's all well the p potatoes the carrots mm -hmm. yep. i won't need more than a more than a few will i um, take as much as you can carry, really. That way you got it. Because you guys are going to be hungry for a while. When I first got here and saw that Bigfoot walking around, I thought it was one of you guys with some new skin mod. Because <laughs> <laughs> he just walked past me, started picking up something. I'm like, oh, that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> no, dude, he's been chilling there since December. <laughs> just walking around. He's got like 45k fiber on him. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. So... Yeah, I have, <laughs> I have so much fiber. Oh, funny. <laughs> oh man. Right, I'll put the put the put the carrots and I my bird then. Yeah, I have almost eighteen full stacks of fiber, three hundred k per stack. <laughs> I know it's that. It's like holy shit. You're going to the thatching business, are you? Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna open my own sweatshop here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> here, so I'll show you around in here, Trench, if you need something. Um, over here, in the very first one, those are all the perfect breeders that we have. And that, what perfect means is it just has the best stats. 
of everything yeah. that we blended together and got them. Then we go into just the basics like large carnos, small carnos. These are the ones that we tamed. Herbivores, flyers, bugs, utility dinos, small shoulders. In the back corner here we got unpaired ones. These are ones that we just need to get a second one for to pair them up. Um, got one for colors here, but I'm going to do something different on that. I don't know. I got basically an Ovis vending machine, so if you need some mutton, you can just pop out some Ovis, level them up, and murder them. Yep. Uh, then we got yeah, the various animals, basils, and all that. Things that we've been mutating. And Rexus for the boss battle. You guys still haven't gotten a rhino yet, have you? No, we haven't. We got to breed up the bronchos oh. and, and go get one. We found a 150. That's those are out. like the most. Fun. They're the most fun to have because it's like flying a helicopter around. It makes the same sound. I know it does. It's just crazy. <laughs> it's you can crazy. pick up stuff. You know, I, I I use those for farming metal with an Aki, and it's so much easier than an RG for farming. Really? Well, we'll have to go get one then. We'll oh yeah. Breed up some of the. We're gonna need to. Because you can go up right? and down. You don't. You don't have to do those bypasses like an RG. You know, you have to keep circling around. You can go up and down with a Rhino. Oh, nice. Like, they're really cool. But you can't breed them unless you have some kind of mod on. So yeah. if you could build a big pen to trap on, you could do that and just get as many as you want. That might be something to do then. Yeah, the traps I've seen are huge. I've never built one. Like The problem I have is that you don't have all the resources. Um yeah, they use for the for the levels. So, but even if you don't, you still get a low level at least. They're still pretty good to use. They're not good for killing stuff with, but they're great for uh, farming and picking up any dino, even a rex, and flying around the map. Yeah, well, we've been talking about getting them. We got to get a couple pheromones and all that. We've got the uh, we've got a 150 on the map now, so that's good. Sure. And it is a female. I'll make right? sure to stay away from it. I don't, I don't yeah. need you guys asking me tomorrow where the 150 going. <laughs> now all of a sudden I have a bunch of chitin. <laughs> yeah, I'll give you chitin. <laughs> oh, we've got chitin for days, man. You don't need yeah. to do that, okay? <laughs> and Akatina faced. We, we can show you how to get loads of chitin real quick. You take the uh, Megatherium in the one cave. Oh, God, yeah. The one, the one north of my base. You take a berry in, yep. you walk out a thousand chitin. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, did you ever play the Fjorder map? Yep, yeah, I played them all. Yeah, I like even that ones map. that aren't even released. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty good. I like that one. That was one of my favorites. I think my favorite is still um, Ragnarok. Yep. Something about that map. A lot of great places to build. Lots of room. Did that go? All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and wrap it up tonight. Thanks for joining me, everyone. Welcome to the party trench. Gameplay already left us this evening, but we also got Titus here. We got Neil and, of course, Hobbit. I'm going to have to make like a roll call and stuff from now on. So many people in here. <laughs> roll call. Sort of sign and cheat. Yeah. I'm here. <laughs> right. Good. Hey, good. Beef. Yeah. I made us a present over here. But we'll go and wrap up the stream. Let me see where are you. All right. Thank you very much again, Hobbit. You're a star. What do you got, Hobbit? When are you on next, uh, Beef? It'll be Thursday night we're on. But like I said, feel free to hop on any time. This thing's running 24-7. And I'm going to yeah. up, set up a Discord um, chat for all you guys. So if you want to. Hey, thanks, Martin. I appreciate it, man. Good to have you. Stop by again See on later, Thursday. Everybody. We're going to be doing some more interesting stuff on Thursday. Tonight was just kind of goofing around, um, hunting a little bit, and welcoming someone new to the tribe. So Thursday we'll have a little more structure. Awesome. All right, guys. We'll catch you next time. If you haven't done so, leave a like on the stream. And don't forget to subscribe and ring that bell for notifications. I'll see you next time. Until then, peace. Peace. Yeah, catch you later.